Hello everybody and a very good afternoon. Welcome back to Crafters TV. My name is Ben Mosby. It's Friday. Woohoo! And it is the Crafters Christmas shopping day. Crafters Crafters TV Christmas shopping day. Crafters companion Crafters TV Christmas shopping day. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Oh yeah. And the crowd said, "Yeah." Yeah. yeah. Woo. The crowd went whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. And the crowd threw money. Uh, no, none no. of that. Um, yeah, we're here for what is going to be a fantastic couple of shows. If you were here on Wake Up Call this morning, you will know all about it. Uh, this is the last day, really, we're saying, with your best chance to get your Christmas goodies. So if you're looking to buy Christmas presents, this is last chance saloon. The best chance for you to get those goodies delivered in time for Christmas. So shop today, and there's plenty of incentives for you as well to be shopping with us. Uh, first of all, one which you may know about if you've been shopping over the last few days, with the postage. If you're here in the UK, it is free shipping across everything up until Monday, the 18th of December. So, you know what, get shopping today, use that free shipping, get those last minute gifts, uh, get them in your basket, get them checked out. If you're in the US, you've got free shipping when you spend over $50. If you're in the EU, you've got free shipping if you spend over 20 euros. So that's great, we've got the shipping incentive. Wouldn't it be nice if we threw a few extra points your way? Yep. How about triple points? Yeah. 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 Woo. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Tri yeah. Woo. Woo. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. 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 Please. Yeah. Triple points. Woo. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. The crowd love it. Uh, triple points on everything. So. Use that postage incentive, use the point incentive, use the fact that today is the day that you need to be shopping for your best chance for Christmas delivery and hit the website up. Outlet sales still there up to 70% off and across this show, there's so many great deals for you that we're gonna get through as many as we can, but you can get there before us, hit the shop the show, shop the day pages and you can see all of the deals before we get there. And we have got some absolute crackers. With me over the course of this show, I'd like to say my partner in crime from Wake Up Call this morning, she did such a fabulous job. She's landed another show, it's Lily. Well done. Thank you, thank you. I'm back. Ready for another brilliant show? Yeah. Cannot wait for this one. Super busy on this morning's wake up call. So thank you so much to everyone who joined us this morning. But don't wait, you're not too, don't worry even, you're not too late to join the party. Still lots of bargains in store. We're going to try and fit in as many as we possibly can in this show because like Ben says, this is our, your sort of last day, last chance uh, for the best chance of yeah. Christmas delivery. So get yourself a bargain, whether it's going to be a gift for a loved one or as I did for myself this morning before we came live, a gift for yourself. Oh! Can you save it up to the website? Of course I placed an order. What you know what I'm like? I have to say, a lot of storage. So oh. I'm thinking, do you know what, over Christmas, a little bit of time away from the office, I'm going to make sure my storage and my organisation in my craft room is up to scratch. So what I did, I ordered hmm, quite a few magnetic sheets. When I say quite a few, 70. What? 70 magnetic sheets, yep. Mm -hmm. Why not? Seven zero. Seven zero, yeah. They come in packs of five, so... Fourteen packs. Fourteen packs, yep. Yeah. I ordered a couple, no, not a couple, three of the Totally Tiffany Fab Files and a load of the Divider Pockets as and well. And a partridge in a pear much. tree. I think that's probably the only thing that wasn't on my order at this point. I just, well, I, I just kind of feel, though, correct me if I'm wrong, I'm sure that you, last time we were on together, or the time before you were talking about making a big order for storage, uh -huh. how much storage do you actually need? This is well, <laughs> well, well, this is the thing. I'm going at like one area of my craft at a time. So last time we were on it was the paper takers, wasn't it? And I think, and I ordered 20 at that time. I think it might have been 20. Uh, so I'd, I've sorted out, sorted out all my paper, all my card. That's all in tow, that's all fabulous. I have to say, very proud of the way it's been organized. Pat on the back for Lily. But next up is dies. Dice. So what I'm thinking is, I've got so many, I'll be honest, I've literally got thousands of dice. So it's not really feasible to store them all on magnetic sheets because that would literally be thousands of magnetic sheets. Mm. So what I'm going to do is for the dice that I use the most, so basically my nesting dies, uh, for those I'm going to get all of those on magnetic sheets. It's going to be a big job. I'm going to need at least 70. I thought I'll start off with 70. Outlet sale as well, by the way. Some oh, of yeah. the uh, totally goodies were in the outlet sale. I thought, you know what, triple points. Today's the day to do it because at the end of the day, I want that stuff in here um, before Christmas. 
so I'm getting it done over Christmas. That's I, why I placed a rather large order. Oh, so plan to do it over Christmas rather than get everything done before Christmas, because if you've only got Oof. 10 days left, haven't you? There's no way I'm going to... If you see the amount of nesting dice I've got, there's no way that's going to get done before Christmas. No. I thought I'd get the goodies in time for Christmas. That can be my over Christmas project. Well, there you go. Um, how you shop. It is how you shop. When there's bargains on, you take advantage. You order 70. Yes. You do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a way to do it. Tip from the top there. That's how, that's how you shop if you want to be at the top. Shop to the top. Shop to the top. Um, it's going to be a good show this. We've got Radical Rachel on the socials. Um, whoop, whoop. Radical Rachel's um, last shift before <gasps> holes. She's going on holiday. Uh, she's told me she's packing me in a suitcase as well. Haven't you, Rachel? Yeah, yeah mm. smile and nod, smile and nod. She's taking me with her. She's going away somewhere hot. I know, that's why she's taking me. Mm. Can I? Room for a big one? Yeah, big suitcase, be yeah. fine. I'll, pro I'll take up all of your luggage allowance plus more. Yeah. See, I, right. I call, I'll go on as a uh, hand luggage. You could be like the main carry-all. <laughs> you go on the hand luggage. I can, you know, curl up small. <laughs> you, you could be all sorts. Why if is that moving? you hand luggage, a lily. <laughs> <laughs> do, what, a flower? Yeah. Yeah, yeah just a flower, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll give it a go. Go on, Rachel, go on. Humor us, please. Give it a go. <laughs> anyway. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Just to let you know, uh, Crafter's Companion does not <laughs> condone putting people in suitcases uh, at all, at any point. Uh, Geraldine joins us saying good afternoon, Ben, Lily and everyone from a still soaking Argyle and Butte. I'm wishing Ooh. you all sparkle and joy. Well, we're sending you back that sparkle mm -hmm. and joy. Uh, Teresa says hi, everyone. Hello. Caroline Hanley says good day from the Isle of Man. Well, good day. Good day. Good day from the northeast uh, missed this morning's show but i've raced home to watch this one just been told by mum she wants to buy some cc stuff for christmas for me so that's fabulous Ooh, that is good winning today mm. winning jessica stricker joins us good morning good morning, morning. uh carletta joins us carletta morris says good morning everyone from arkansas good morning morning uh jane adams joins us saying hi everyone from las vegas Ooh, hello. Uh, oh hello uh oh and then a message from rachel which says ha 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 Hmm. Uh, Nick is in there first. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Uh, three three cases, maybe? She's only taking hand luggage. Oh, three hand luggage, it will be fine. Absolutely fine. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I've got no chance, afternoon. have I? Afternoon. Uh, I'm watching whilst wrapping presents, and I've already lost my scissors twice, says Kirsty uh, D. Oh. Happens that, doesn't it? We, by the way, we do have a good deal on some scissors today if we need some more scissors. So if you've lost those ones and you can't find them. We've got the deal for you. Um, Jen Shanks says, good morning, Lily, Ben and team. Uh, thank you, everyone, for joining us. We had a great show this morning. We're back. Um, we had a little bit of a Christmas um, shindig in between shows. Well, I say mm. shindig, bit of a get together, wasn't we it? We had a quiz master over that. Oh. oh, yeah. Ben, the famous quiz master. Yeah. Did a cracking job. Yeah. They no. weren't easy. Uh, especially if you don't watch films. I think I got about two of the answers. Luckily, we were on a team, and my team was a lot better than I was, because otherwise it would have been embarrassing, let's be mm. honest. But we had, we had good fun, that's for sure. Yeah, it was, it was, good, it was good fun. It was, um, yeah. I, if, 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 you, if you want, during the show, I could fire a few of the questions at you. Just, mm. just, just let, let us know. We might do that through the show. Uh, we're going to start off, though, with stockings. It's a B for me. Uh, B for Ben. Now, just before you get too excited, you don't get the stocking, all right? Aww. It's just there for, I know. It's just there for illustrative, illustrative, illustrative? Illustrative. Illustrative. Not illustrative. 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 That's the one. Illustrative purposes. Basically, you don't get the stocking. You it's all he's trying to say. Yeah, it just, just, it just it looks, makes it look nice. It looks nice better than putting it in a cardboard box, isn't it? True. You will get all the contents within it, though. So it's 55 93 73 77 worth of goodies that you're picking up for 20 quid if you're platinum. $28. So let me empty what I said earlier on. Empty let me your stocking. Take me stocking off. Now, you, uh, Ray, you're going to get uh, all of these goodies, right? So here's your value. And by the way, if you like, look at my stocking, wait till you see the stocking that Lily's going to show you in just a few moments' bigger. time. It is. It's hashtag Lily Sarah's, Lily slash Sarah's stocking. Yeah. It's a big one. We could, we'll share. It's that big. We can share. Mm. Mine sort of, you know, it, it, it's a small one, but, you know, it's, it's good quality stuff small inside mine. Small but perfectly formed, shall we say. Yes. There you go. So you've got cutting embossed folders in here, beautiful floral frame. This is your um, dancing 
daffodils. So beautiful embossed yellow sheath from this, and you'll get that lovely frame in there as well. Um, it's five and a half by five and a half, so lovely size to be working with that you're paying for. Also, this which is one of our um, stamp sentiment sets. It's your friendship. It's actually special friend. So you've got special friend in lots of different um, fonts and types for you. Perfect for all sorts of different occasions. You've got like, your block capitals, you've got your uh, cursive, you've got your sort of type that looks like it's come straight off a typewriter as well. But really lovely, uh, different styles of sentiment. And you're also gonna get your whimsical texture stamps, which came from the Enchanted Dreams collection. So five stamps in total there. That's your value, more than your value actually, if you're packing them. So 20 pounds or 28 dollars and then for free we're going to throw in your pom-pom makers um, so these will allow you to make um, pom-poms three and a half five and a half seven and nine centimeters you get the little makers themselves not the yarn so you will need to add that in separately into um, we need to get that elsewhere you might already have some at home you are also going to get your tape pen dotty tape pen this time around um, and again just to mention with these I know a lot of people are very excited about the refillable tape pens of course those are still available we will be doing those in smaller configurations in the new year but we're still continuing with these so if you still prefer the standard tape pens then you can still get them we'll give you that for free in the bundle we're also going to give you for free one of our fantastic uh, sentiment dies. Um, beautiful this because it's kind of an edgeable which is going to cut half of the message into your cardstock and pop the hello onto the top hello of your cardstock. You. Hello you. Uh, so that is included for free and you're also going to get your beautiful Bella Luna vellum in this bundle for absolutely nothing. That is 24 sheets of that beautiful vellum uh, for free within the bundle. It's been very busy today, this one. Um, so get it in your basket. Get your triple points as well, 20 pounds or 28 dollars. And as much as we have got your stocking fillers coming up, five pound, 10 pound stocking fillers, um, there's loads of little stocking fillering bits there as well. So even if you've got a few of the bits in that stocking, pick them up, keep the bits that you need, give the others away as Christmas gifts, you're sorted. Triple points. Don't forget your free shipping here in the UK as well. But my stocking, good. Sarah slash Lily stocking. This is the never ending stocking. This morning when Lily started taking stuff out of the stocking, I thought there was a hole in the stocking and she was pulling stuff up from the floor. You'll see what I mean when you see it now. Honestly, look at this. My stocking is better than Ben's stocking. <laughs> look at this, right. First up, I mean, the stocking is jam packed full itself. But what? There's even one thing that doesn't even fit in the stocking. That you is win. how amazing this is. Yeah, I've won already. You won. Even just with this paper pad. Now, first up, let's have a little look at the details on your screen. So, I know it's Sarah's Christmas stocking, but uh, I hope she'll let me share. Let's, let's have it as Sarah and Lily's Christmas stocking. Sarah, Sir Lily. Please, please let me share. A Sir Lily stocking. I want this, it's good. Sir Lily. Yeah. Sounds like Sir Lily. Sir I, Lily. Like I'm a Sir. <laughs> I'm not a Sir, but anyway, hey ho. <laughs> uh, your platinum price on this amazing stocking is just £24 or $32. That means you're saving, wow, nearly £80 or over $100. How incredible is that? So let's start off with our amazing paper pad. 37 glorious sheets included. It's coming to us as part of the Sarah Signature Wild at Heart collection. And this is certainly dear to my heart. This is just right up my street. I love animal prints. Anything animal print, whether it's leopard prints, your zebra prints, I adore. And anything mm. floral, I'm also a huge fan of. So the fact that we fuse those two themes together, this for me is like an absolute dream in a paper pad. That is just beautiful. You've got the choice of whether you just want to go for the animal print or whether you want to go for the designs that bring together both the florals and the animal prints. You have so much choice with this paper pad. Once again, like many of our paper pads, it is uncoated, which means you can add your additional finishes onto there, whether it's going to be flecks of glitter, gilding, whether it's going to be glues, inks onto there as well. You can absolutely do all those different techniques with it being uncoated. You're getting double-sided prints on here as well, so it's going to be ideal for those paper folding techniques, box making as well. And then as we come to that final page, that 37th page, we also have all of our sentiments there. Just take your guillotine or your trimmer to those, or even just a pair of scissors or a craft knife, and you've got tons and tons of individual sentiments. Yeah. Incredible value there to get 37 double-sided sheets, 180 GSM, and that is just one small part of this amazing Christmas stocking. Amazing. So let's delve into our stocking. Oh my goodness me, there is literally so much in Hopefully you sat down, because this takes about half an hour, this bit. I'm gonna to have to take a long old deep breath here because honestly, there is absolutely tons. And you think you've taken it all out of the stocking, then I have a look inside and there's even more. The amount you're getting is incredible. Right, that is definitely it. Let's start off with, let's start off with the stencil. 
and we're actually talking about this particular stencil on Wednesday with Sheena and we were both saying how much we love this stencil because it's one of those that's just so versatile. Spots and dots you're going to be using time and time again, whether it's going to be girly makes, masculine makes, maybe it's even going to be creations for Christmas, maybe that's going to be like snowfall that you've got on that border, you can absolutely do it with this fantastic three-piece set of stencils. Your largest stencil is an absolute whopper at <laughs> eight and a half inch square. That is a huge stencil. Even if you like making big cars like me, that is still going to work a treat. Then we bring to you the border stencil as well, that beautiful graduated dot design. And we've also got that almost like a radiating circle as your topper stencil onto there. You can see on the packaging we've used some of our fantastic gilding paste, uh, glitter paste even. Yeah. You will find those on the website. We'll be featuring those actually over the weekend on Crafters TV. Got a few techniques to share with you with those on Sunday. But it's not just about your glitter paste. You can use that stencil with your inks, your sprays. You can even emboss that through your die cutting machine as well. So tons and tons of versatility with that one stencil set. Let's move on next to some sentiment dies. Fantastic set of dies that are going to spell out just for you as part of this set. Nine different layering dies within here. Cut them all in different cardstocks in different colours and you can start to build up that fantastic design to give you a really fun sentiment onto any of your projects. Then we move on to this adorable little gnome. I mean, no way. No way that's included. There you go. Jokes are coming out already <laughs> 17 minutes past. Hang tight, guys. It's going to be a fun show. You've got your stamps and dies and stencils in this collection I'm as well. I'm that. Love this one. It's our gnome boy. You've got all the different accessories. He can be holding. Maybe it's, he's gone fishing or maybe he's holding some flowers. He's doing his barbecue. Tons and tons of options to start building that design together. And the addition of those stencils means you can add different prints and patterns onto his clothes as well, which is super cool. Then we have got some dies that are going to allow Ooh, you to make your yeah. very own flowers. Whether it's going to be card, paper, vellum or flower forming foam, you can do it with these fantastic dies. The flower layers included as well as the leaves and that centre statement as well. So lots and lots of layering options with those fantastic dies. Then we come on to this adorable little doggy. I mean, look at him. He's Dude. just so cute. You've got all your sentiments as well. You've got things like you're the top dog, your uh, yappy birthday, which I think is Yappy fabulous. birthday. Is that what it says? Yeah, yappy birthday. Brilliant. Love that. That is just a bent set of stamps and yes. dies, isn't it? Right there. You've got both the front and the back of your little doggy and that die allows you to create this into a little gift tag or it could be a bookmark or anything you so choose just a fantastic set of stamps and dies now this is going to be a really useful one isn't mm. it because we've got florals we've got hearts we've got butterflies all those sorts of designs that we use in our car making and scrapbooking and home decor and gift making time and time again are included in this fantastic set of stamps and dies all you need to do is just stamp your image and die cut those images out and you've got ready-made embellishments all good to go but then we're going to start to think about all things Christmas. Now, maybe like me, like we were saying on this morning's show, and I've made a total of one Christmas card. Way. Brilliant. Well done, Lily. Pat on the back. Started last night. Started my uh, Christmas crafting for myself last night. But uh, anyway, if you're last minute like me, we've still got time to make our cra uh, Christmas cards, Christmas gifts. It could be crackers for the table. Because I think yeah. a lot of us, we think about our Christmas cards first, then our, our gift wrapping. And then I think we start to think about our table decorations and things for Christmas Day itself. These are going to be ideal for those last minute makes. Just add these as an embellishment and it's going to take that project to the next level. These are chipboards for the 3D and they are uh, self-adhesive as well. Absolutely beautiful. You've even got some metallic on there coming to us from the Violet Studios Nutcracker range. Just absolutely fantastic. Then we move on to one of my actual favourite dies. I love this die. Beautiful, Butterfly yeah. mini die. It's one of those dies that you'll just be using time and time again as a finishing touch or to hide, as we call them, a crafty boo-boo. <laughs> Very useful one with that one. Then we come to another item from Violet Studios. This comes to us as part of our Home for Christmas collection. Did say early on, I am matching pretty nicely with these pom-poms today. You're getting 36 mini pom-poms. I know they're part of a Christmas collection, but of course you can be using these colourways all year round as well. Great in your soft crafts or just an, as an embellishment on cards. I love to actually add these onto the centre of a ribbon bow. I think that works quite nicely. And then we've actually got some essential tools included as part of this never-ending stocking. We have got three rolls of your low-tack tape, uh, 75 metres on each, so an awful lot of sticking power there. You can be using that for taping your dies down. Uh, you can be using it for masking techniques with your stencils as well. Just one of those you have to have in your crafty stash, that is for sure. And then we also have another essential tool, which is our edge crimper. allows you to create that distressed edge effect on the edges of your cardstock and your papers as well. Very easy to create that sort of look and feel with that 
all. And then finally, yes, it does go on and on and on and on. Does this gift bag, you have got your fantastic set of stamens. 400 stamens in total. You've got your darker green and your lighter green. Great for adding to the center of your flowers, whether they be foam or paper. Those are going to last you an awfully long time. My goodness me. Are you done? All, just about. Whew. All of that for £24 or $32. Good grief. I know I said my stocking was better than Ben's. But it is. It is. Look at all that. You want all that. I know you do. You might want Ben's as well. You can go for both. But if you're only picking one, do it. While you can. I'm going to get myself into some trouble today, aren't I? I can, I can see it. Mm. Pat, thank you, Pat. The Christmas stockings are terrific. They are the stockings. Uh, that thank must you. be a typo. She must have meant to put stockings. The, the, stockings. Very easy to do. It says stockings are yeah. terrific for people just getting involved with crafting. Yes. Oh, yeah. That's a good shout, actually. You cannot beat the value of the items. Um, good afternoon, says uh, Kirsty D. She's in. Uh, Jen Shank is with us. And Michael Adams says, good afternoon. Ben and Lily, you both look amazing. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Merry Christmas from Stephanie, Michael, 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 Stephanie, Michael and Acule. Acule is his, um, the, his desktop vacuum that he's dressed up to look like Acule Poirot. Uh, Jules Gordon's ordered a few treats and Rhonda says, yes, Rhonda, yes, Rhonda. Sarah plus Lily equals silly. <laughs> it's the silly stocking. Uh, talking to silly, five pound, five dollar deals for you. Let's rattle through these. Um, the four pounds or four dollars if you're a platinum member, little stocking fillers, all right? So uh, if your storage you're after, like someone we know. I, I, I wonder who that is. Could be me. The Karen Buddy bag, uh, this one, um, you won't get the little inserts with this. You're only going to get the bag, but you can buy the little um, pockets to put in here. Very handy uh -huh. for storing. <laughs> yeah. What, what, what did you bought? I think it was about 20 of those. I wonder, wonder who that was. Uh, who ordered 20? Somebody very silly. I who can't imagine who that could be. Who would have ordered 20 of those? Who, I mean, would, have, who would have ordered 70 magnetic sheets as well? Who I mean, really? would need 70 magnetic sheets? Because the magnetic sheets go really nicely into the little into the little um, compartments That's there as well. That's exactly what I was I mean, thinking. I just don't know. Don't know who do would need that many? I don't know. Matt, you know. Can you help us at home? Who could it be? Who? It's a Christmas mystery. It's a mystery. <laughs> it's a mystery. Uh, yeah, I mean, who would? Who would do that? Who, I mean, Seriously? Who? Who, who spends that much money on storage? Who, who spends that money on storage? Thankfully, you don't have to spend a lot of money because Karen is just four pounds or four dollars today. You do get the little um, inner plastic area that so it keeps everything nice and neat and tidy. And of course, that hook and loop over the front, keeping everything in place. Um, and it's see-through, it's wiped clean. You've got your little handle there as well. So it's nice and easy to store, nice and easy to take off the shelf. That is a great deal um, mm -hmm. at $7.99 or $9.99. But four pounds or four dollars if you're platinum is an incredible buy. So if you are like someone, you know, who needs a lot of storage, mm -hmm. then you've got the, the opportune moment to jump in and grab that. <laughs> Lily. Uh, do you know what? I didn't order any of those this morning. I'm thinking now. Oh, you I now. might need some. Oh dear. Oh dear. Get in before I can because yeah. when I order, I order. I won't be ordering one. I never order anything in singles. What's the point? Order it's all good points. news today. No and the fact that you've got your shipping incentive, you've got your triple points, but it's bad news that Lily's shopping. Yeah. Um, so a lot you know of what? the deals will go. Do you know what's good news is that I'm on this show till five o'clock. So guys at home, you've got an hour and a half. Get in before I can. So as yeah. soon as I come off here, even before I head up to the shops and head off home, I'll be shopping again. What am I like? What am I like? What is she like? Yeah. Uh, get that whilst you can. Nutcracker. This again is a great deal. Here we go. This is what we're talking about. 50% uh -huh. of the stock of the Nutcracker uh, Violet Studio collection gone. This actually, I, I think whether you're buying this as a present or perhaps you're somebody who loves a bit of embroidery, maybe you sort of dabbled in a bit of soft craft, but you know, you don't want to spend a huge amount of money on it, but you still like to have something there to sort of keep you busy. This is a great one to go for. Normally a tenner, normally 13 pounds, but again, it's down to a fiver. Uh, half price and then you've got that platinum discount as well of course if you're within the club so four pounds or four dollars it allows you to create your four different designs here so you've got the little ballerina you've got the um, little nutcracker himself beautiful little floral um, embroidery hoop and then you've got well I suppose it's like your moon and stars they're not specifically sort of nutcrackery but you get everything in there that you need to be able to um, pop those together including your embroidery hoops you've got your thread 
uh, all of your fabric in there as well and your um, your detailed guide in there too so as I said whether you perhaps are buying this as a gift for somebody or you're thinking about potentially getting this for yourself to then make I mean you might make a couple of these in time for this Christmas but if not again you can put it away uh, and use it next year but go quickly if you do want to get it because half of the stock has already gone also in our five pound five dollar stocking filler section <laughs> Double-sided foam sheets, A4 size, you're getting five of these um, in different um, depths as well because you've got your uh, one mil, two mil and three mil. I mean, and these are, in essence, just like the biggest foam pads you're ever likely to see. And it, um, if you want to obviously strip these down, you can cut these down, snip into them. Um, I was saying, it wasn't Lisa, it must have been, it must have been, I think it was Michelle who just like, you know, cut almost a third off one recently for like a, a project and put like uh, gilding flakes all over it you can pop your glitter on here as well mm. it's nice to have these kind of alongside your sort of standard foam pads isn't mm. it because then you've got you've got choice haven't you absolutely i'll be, I'll be honest i always say and me and craig use the same uh, expression we're adhesive geeks you've What's got that? to have adhesive geeks adhesive geeks adhesive yeah geeks. okay you've got to have all the different adhesives i have all the foam pads yeah i have all the sizes of course i do multiples of each don't worry guys at home Foam on a roll, different sizes. So even here, when I'm demoing today, I've yeah. always got the uh, narrower one that can bend round curves. Always use that for my shakers. And I also have the smaller one always beside me. But I'm loving those sheets at the moment. And especially at that price point, it's amazing. Don't forget as well, because you've got the backing on both sides, you mm. can actually die cut those. Yeah. So in the past, we've brought you some of our uh, double-sided foam like embellishments that have been pre-cut. You can create your own using your dies and using those sheets. So don't just think about it as sort of like a... Um, a necessary adhesive if you like think about using it to create your own embellishments and backgrounds as well and i love the fact that you get the three different depths because sometimes you just want a little bit of lift yeah. and sometimes you need lifting up quite a bit let's be honest so uh, it's great that you get all three included yeah i might be ordering some more of those after this show because i get through those like a do dose of salts as you can probably imagine you get through them like a what like a dose of salts have you never heard that one? A dozy salt. A dose of salt. I've never heard that expression. It must before. be a northern expression. Oh. Anyone in my ear? Does anybody recognise? No. 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 It might be one of those that my family uses that no one else has ever heard. But yeah, get through it like a dose of salts. Yeah, like a dose of, of salt. salts. Yeah. Uh, Rachel knows that one. Oh, Rachel knows that. Oh, That's thank good. goodness. You thank you, Rachel. I uh, thought I was going mad for about the hundredth time today already. Four pounds, four dollars. Grab it whilst you can. Uh, love the adhesive foam pads to cut out large sentiments, says Shadaya. Oh, yeah. uh, she also says, I did my order yesterday and thank you. It will be here before the mad holiday rush. Thank you to customer service. Uh, and Carleen says, I've just got my last orders in. Two huge boxes. Hubby asked if I'd ordered bricks as they were so heavy. <laughs> Uh, it's all those special paper boxes. Oh, yeah. They weigh oh. nine pounds a go, those. They were so brilliant. I love those papers. They're gorgeous. I think they're gone now, aren't they? I know. I'm glad I've got mine. It's on my shelf as well. It looks amazing on, you, on your shelves in your craft room. Top tip. Now, the Easy Grip mat uh, is selling very, very quickly indeed. Um, now, I apologise oh. again. Who's it, had a nibble of that? Who has had... Is it, is it actually Sheena? It was Sheena, Sheena who's had a nibble. However, good to kind of show you that, because um, I remember when we launched this and Leanne had it and she did exactly the same. She mm. was like snipping into hers and cutting into hers um, because these are absolutely brilliant to, um, I mean, it's, you've basically got a super secure hold, whether you're laying it that side or that side, it doesn't really matter. Um, and what Leanne was doing when she had hers is she was cutting out little um, pieces like that, popping it down. I've got my little, which we'll pretend that's an ink pad. I got, or have I got one under here? No. But what she was doing was when she was doing her um, inking off her pad, sometimes rather than like having to hold the pad mm -hmm. and then use your door with the other hand, you want to have a free hand. So it sticks so well mm -hmm. to the surface that you can do everything one-handed. Absolutely. Shall I tell you what's brilliant, brilliant for as well? Yeah. Of course, it's great for your crafting, and it, th that's the main use for me with my ink pads. But think about getting maybe a couple of packs of these, especially at that price. One for your crafting, one for around the home. So imagine if you, uh, perhaps you have a caravan, uh, and you've got uh, a tray. There we go. It is stuck. It's never coming up. Anyway. Sorry, uh, yeah, go on. There we go. Tray. Uses around the home. So you've got a tray that you're carrying maybe a couple of mugs of hot drink on, right? You don't want them to slide around. You don't. That's want them to a fall cracking over. idea. Pop one of them. Yeah, honestly, pop one of them on there. It's going to stop them sliding around. I'll tell you what else it's great for around the home. Maybe you've got a small child or a little baby who you're um, still in a high chair. Yeah. You're sort of getting them to learn to feed themselves. 
cut a strip of that, pop it on the top of their high chair where the, the plate would sit, pop the plate on top, and they're not going to be ch chasing the plate all around. It's not going to end up on the floor. It's going to be gripped, not I just for your crafting. It's all around the home. Honestly, they are absolutely amazing mats. I would definitely say get one for your crafting, get one for around the home. It's one of those you don't know you need it until, until you've got it. Yeah, I thought absolutely. you were going to say when you said if you've got a baby, what you want to do is put, put the that on the on seat it. of the high chair and then put the baby on top and they won't be able to wiggle all around and take yeah, the food everywhere. That'd be brilliant. Yeah. But no, not for that. Put, no. put it on top of their, their high chair where, their, where the plates are. Yeah. But basically anything around the home that you don't want to sort of slide around, you don't want to move around, sort on trays, maybe you've got somebody mm -hmm. who is uh, elderly and they struggle to keep their, their dinner tray uh, their dinner plate on the tray of course pop that onto that tray and their plates are going to move around it's going to make it so much easier that is an amazing price you're saving over 40 percent honestly my top tip yeah. get yourself a couple of packs it's 10 and a half by 12 so you might you know you might want to get one to kind of snip into uh, mm. for things like your ink pads and then get another one to yeah another idea use it for trays use it for the baby i mean like you say at four pounds or four dollars you can afford to multi-order these mm. nine pounds twelve dollars normally uh, four pounds or four dollars today that's going fast very quick indeed as are the um, foam sheets as are actually across the board the um, card and envelope packs that we've um, launched fairly recently actually um, been one of the top sellers across the day today we have various uh, different card types and various different sizes for you over on the website cannot believe that we're doing this for you at 7.99 or 11.95 to get um, 100 so 50 envelopes 50 of your um, cards ready to go um, pre-scored simply just going to fold and away you go for four pounds and four dollars if you also want to get the um, cello bags to go with these did have a look that the uh, five by five cello bags is also available for you on the website too so you can jump in and grab those and if you love the idea of having your uh, ready to go cards ready to go envelopes do check the website because there's a whole host of different sizes and different card stocks available for you. But to get that pack at four pounds or four dollars if you're platinum, you're stocking up there. Um, well, multi-order. If you, you're getting two for the price of one if you're platinum, basically, mm. aren't you? So uh, get as many of those as you can, proving very, very popular indeed. And as I say, check the web for other sizes um, available to you. And the last one from me, uh, again for a fiver. Uh, from Violet Studios is the Make Your Own Floral Wreath Kit. Uh, this is super cute again because you get everything you need to be able to um, create that beautiful wreath. If I kind of um, spin it around again, you can see um, everything in there. In addition to the um, kit, you oh, we'll just say you will need um, some tools. So you'll need your um, scissors. Um, so you've obviously got those already. If you haven't got some on the show, hot glue gun um, and your glue pins as well. But you've got. Um, your templates in there you've got your ring you've got your little buttons and um, some of your felt in there too um, so absolutely worth jumping in for maybe as a gift or a little project to try and do in the new year normally 12.99 or 11.69 four pounds or four dollars is the price on that um again nice little christmas gift little stocking filler we'll need a fairly big stocking to fit that into though because um, it's quite big. Maybe yeah, if you've got one the size of Lily's over the other side of the studio, obviously won't fit in my tiny Your stocking. Your tiny little stocking. My little tiny Might stocking. Might fit in my nice roomy stocking. Mind you, I said roomy. There's not, not much room left in there. Well, no. you know, well it's packed full. I know, it's absolutely chocker. Blowing, I know. That's the silly stocking over that side of the studio. The silly so stocking? The Sarah Lily, silly. Oh, it is yeah. silly. The value is silly. I I'll know. give you that one. That's I for know. sure. Um, Hi to Sally, who says, hey up, Ben. Hey up. Lily just popped on to wish you all, oh, hey up, Ben and Lily. Hey up. Hey up. Do you actually say hey up? Hey up, yeah. yeah. You do. Yeah. Um, just popped on to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Oh, I'm hashtag well down now. We fly to Florida tomorrow. <gasps> oh. So I might not be able to catch any shows next week, so I thought I'd say it while I could. Well, Sally, have a brilliant time in Florida. Mm. Are you there for the whole vacation christmas vacation that, i mean that's a place to go for christmas oh, isn't it oh gosh yeah wow enjoy it sounds fabulous not jealous at all don't worry not no jealous. have a great time and thank you for messaging merry christmas, mm -hmm. merry um, christmas. and linda armstead says i like the craft cards and envelopes don't just like like and buy is what i say uh loads of five pound five dollar stocking fillers we've got ten pound ten dollar stocking fillers for you as well uh, and of course our very own stockings that we've got on the show which are proving very popular make sure you shop today your best chance if you're looking for christmas gifts is to buy today uh to get them unnestled under the christmas tree ready for christmas day and don't forget it's triple points today too up until midnight wherever you are and those um, shipping incentives for you as well we're going to take a short break give you opportunity to get those carts and baskets checked out 
that and when we come back we'll look at some more fantastic deals and we've got a little demo to bring to you uh, as well all that coming up we'll see you in about four minutes time Many of our viewers bring it up time and time again, and that's our wax seal seal gate. Thinking though, it might not work as well because I've put too much. <laughs> oh, I've forgotten to put me um, me thing in place. <laughs> because I have a way of words, but I think that doesn't engage with that and can come out all wrong. Water. That, that wasn't the one you just washed your brush in, was it? Sorry, yes, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, it wasn't, was it? <laughs> it was. <laughs> Are you kidding? I'm going to have to say, it's a slip of the tongue. I'm going to say it's maybe to do with my Scottish accent. I'm maybe going to say it's because of Mr. Uh, ben Mosby. He is, well, yeah, he doesn't help matters. Um, I've made pots that have exploded when I fired them. I've done zips in inside out. It happens to everybody. We've all spilt our glitter all over our project or knocked the water over. You're right. I've just noticed I've got my dress on inside out. <laughs> <laughs> so I was messing about doing some backgrounds with the sparkling, took the lid off it and managed to catch the pot somehow and the whole thing came towards me down my front, across my lap, onto the floor. I went to reach for the water and, you know, do the, the, the tapping with the, the... And so there was less tapping and more sort of a tsunami. Um, <laughs> I've got some... <gasps> If you love Crafters TV, we've made it easy for you to watch us wherever you are. Whether you catch us on your tablet or take us with you on your mobile phone, it's easy to watch us anywhere. From here to here. Maybe don't watch us here. It would be easy to watch us here. Probably the easiest place to watch us is here. Crafters TV with you wherever you are. Hi, I'm Ben from Crafters TV. As you may know, we've just launched an amazing new website, our new home of Papercraft to house all of your crafty needs. And as we've had a bit of a makeover, I'm here today to show you how to check out Crafters TV on our sparkling new website, including how to watch live, catch up with previous shows, and how to view the latest schedules. So let's get started. First, go to the Crafters Companion page. Select the correct location at the top of the page. Click the Crafters TV icon on the top right hand side of your screen. To watch the show live on the website, click the Watch Now button in the middle of your screen. You'll be taken to the relevant show page where you can watch the show, shop the show and shop the day at your leisure. To view the Crafters TV schedule, click the View Our Schedule button in the middle of your screen. You'll be taken to the TV schedule where you can browse each date plus all of the shows that are on that day. You can then click on each show to be taken to a page where you can watch and shop the show. If you want to catch up on a previous show, hit the Catch Up button on the purple Crafters TV bar. Then. You can scroll down to see all of the previous Crafters TV shows from recent days. If you're looking for something specific, you can click the Craft Expert, Craft Area, Shows and Date Filters just above the list of shows. Take a moment to browse until you see the show you want to catch up on, then click onto the show. You will then be taken to the catch up page where you're free to watch the show and check out all of the crafty goodies on our shop the show and shop the day pages. Enjoy. Thank you, I will. Digital Ben. Um, Stephanie says, you should see the size of my stocking. And also, Lily and Ben, so nice to see you two together. Thank you. I love your jumpers too. Why are they called jumpers? I don't know, it's called, why do you guys call them sweaters? 
Because you're sweating them. I'm not sweating. No, but you're more likely to than a t-shirt. Whereas jumper, you don't go jumping in them. When you think about it, it doesn't make any sense, does it? Why do we call them jumpers? Answers on a postcard, please. I won't have to Google that and um, find yeah. out. But yeah, I suppose it is a good point. Why wasn't that in your Christmas quiz? Huh? Why wasn't that in the Christmas quiz? Why wasn't that in the Christmas quiz? That is a question. Um, are you want, oh, do you want me? Do you guys want fancy doing a bit of Christmas quiz while we're? All right. I can't obviously do the music rounds, can I? Because I haven't got this here. Thank goodness for that. Um, let us. Let, let, do you always get your kazoo out? Okay. So here's, here's a good one. Oh yeah. Um, when making mince pies. Oh, this one is a, is good, a good one. one. Which way should you stir your mince meat for good luck? When making mince pies, which way should you stir your mince meat for good luck? Uh, pop your answers in. If you're enjoying it, we'll do a few more through the show, just for a bit of fun, obviously. So which way are you stirring your mince meat for good luck? Uh, whilst you're thinking about that, here is a fantastic deal. Is that for the original Academy of Colour? Yeah. Over to Lily. Matt, I'm just about as gobs back to as you are because it's what the? yeah, absolutely ridiculous. If you've not picked this one up already, honestly, there's literally never been a better time to get yourself into that Academy of Colour system. My goodness me, this is amazing! I can't believe you're getting the full original box of the Academy of Colour today. If you're part of our Platinum Club for just £31.99 or $39.99. This is incredible. If you've never seen this before, then my goodness me, this is going to take you on the most incredible colouring journey. It is. Whether you're right at day one, step one on that journey, you've never picked up a pen before, perhaps you've never even heard of an alcohol marker before, this is going to be perfect. But maybe you've been colouring for many years and you just want to progress a little bit further, enhance those skills even more, then this is also going to be ideal. Now, we don't have it here, but you do also get a binder included as well. Oh, yeah. So your binder is it's almost like a, a faux leather sort of look binder. It's a lovely black stylish binder. That's where you can house all of your stamps. If you have collected all of the different Academy of Colour boxes, you can actually uh, pop all of those stamps in that fantastic binder. It's also a great place to store your work so you can see your progress as you move through that, uh, that sort of journey in terms of your colouring. Mm. So what we're going to look at is we're going to look at the fantastic actual box itself. So in addition to the binder, you are getting this amazing box full of goodies. <gasps> This looks amazing on your shelves. I know I've said it a few times, but we seem to have got quite a few uh, fantastic boxes here on today's show. And it's lovely to have them all sort of lined up along your shelves. And this is going to look incredible. It looks so, so expensive, but that price on your screen most certainly is not expensive. So as we open this box, you can see on the front there, we've got the Your Colouring Journey starts here written on the box there. And absolutely, it can start here, but you can start to progress with this box if you've been uh, actually um, colouring for many years. So we take the lid off, and this is the layer that we're going to use in that first demonstration with this fantastic box. This is our all of our alcohol-based pens. These are duo colour aqua. So what you've got here is you've got two different uh, shades, two different tones on each side of the pen. So you've got a dark and a light from the same colour family. You're getting all of those fantastic pens included, including your blender and your darker colours, as well as your light and bright colours. So those are all included. Then we move on to the next layer. And isn't it like the most expensive box of chocolates when you've got all those incredible layers and you move through and you go on that journey, drinking in all of the goodies that you've got as part of this amazing box. Here you've got your duo colour aqua pens. These are the water-based aqua pens, which actually allow you to dilute these water and blend them beautifully. All of those different colours always two different colors on each pen then you get that invaluable opaque white um almost like a thick gel pen if you like that's amazing for adding your highlights it's a 0.9 millimeter nib on there so you get into detail nice and easily then you've got your spritzer and two different paint brushes you've got your wide wash brush and your fine detail one as well yeah and then the final layer full of goodies, Ooh, you get three sets of stamps, wow. uh, three different sheets. We've only got two here, but you do get three included. These are all the images that Leanne colours as part of those online classes. And then finally, you get your watercolour card and also your alcohol marker card in the bottom as well. You will also get a little piece of uh, thick acetate, which is ideal for doing all those palette blending techniques. Amazing to get all of that included. Yeah. But once you get yours home, you will have a little QR code. All you need to do is actually just scan that QR code 
and it will take you to that wealth of education where Leanne has actually shown you all of the different techniques that you can be doing with these fantastic pens and take you through on that educational journey. We've got the binder here, ben, ben very kindly brought this in and you can see here it's got all the different classes but the beauty of your Academy of Colour is each and every single one is standalone. So you don't need all the additional uh, boxes if you don't have those, you can yeah. still get started with just this one box and you've still got all those tutorial videos that you can access with Leanne using these pens and everything that is within the box which is amazing absolutely amazing I mean that education is one of those things yeah. you can't really put a value in uh, which is amazing to get that included it is incredible and if you think about that if you've ever I don't know been to like an evening class or signed up for a course or whatever or if you were getting tuition in I don't know say you were going to learn the piano you've got to think to yourself I'm not going to put a price on it because you know it's not really my place to do it but you've got to think like if you were to go and, um, and pay for a set of piano lessons for example how much you would pay an hour that, that's the way I would look at it and the fact that you're getting like, 18 hours worth of tuition across the Academy of Colour you, you know the kind of value that I'm talking about there and that is nowhere near what we're looking at here let alone for all of the hardware that you're getting as well just a ridiculous price you know and as Lily's touched on um, it, it's one of those things which is going to help you to become the colorist that you want to be it's going to take you on that journey and check out all of the testimonials fire some in at me here as well um, out of everything that we brought you it's the Academy of Colour, I think, where we get people kind of saying, this has changed my crafty life. I never used to be able to colour and kind of look at me now. Um, grab it, try it, you'll absolutely love it. And like Caroline Hanley says, she says, I'm sure that is the cheapest I've ever seen the original mm -hmm. Academy of Colour. I bought one, but I'm very tempted to buy it again at that price. Well, for the consumables, again, why, why wouldn't you at that price absolutely uh, jump in and grab it? Uh, I've been waiting to get these, and now is the time, says Michelle. She's jumping mm -hmm. in for the Academy of Colour. It's worth doing. And just to have a bit of a sneaky peek at this as well, a little bit of a look. Lily's got um, a little demo lined up just to sort of give you a little bit of a, a heads up on how you can use it. Definitely. This is my take on Leanne's amazing edu education. Of course, when you get this box home, you will get Leanne in your own home, so to speak, yeah. through virtual form, of, as, of course, uh, step you through hours and hours of tuition. But this is sort of my take on some of those techniques that Leanne is going to teach you in the class. So all we've done to start with is we've taken some of that fantastic alcohol marker card that is included as part of this box. So you're not even having to buy your card stock separately. It is all included. We've taken one of our uh, alcohol proof ink pads, that one being our uh, flagstone. We've stamped our gorgeous little doggy out. We're going to do a little bit of colouring. So I've taken two pens from the box, and these are all from the same colour family, from that same tan colour family. So we've got TN1, 3, 5 and 6. Lighter numbers, uh, sorry, lighter colours, yep. lower numbers, darker colours are going to be your higher numbers. So nice and easy and self-explanatory when it comes to that numbering system. Then what we're going to do is going to take our TM1, which is our playlist. We're going to focus on one section at a time. I always say start with a small area. Don't try and colour that full image all in one fell swoop. You will struggle uh, a little bit more. It makes it more manageable to work in a smaller area. And as well, it means you'll be working when that ink is still wet. So you'll be blending wet into wet, which is a lot easier to blend than it is to blend mm. dry card. So what we're doing is we're using that beautiful quality brush nib that we have got on these fantastic pens and we're just flicking we're leaving a, uh, a section in the center where it's going to be our, what we call our preserved highlight which is basically an area where there's no color but that's something Leanne will guide you through and explain as part of the classes so if you don't even understand that now do not worry because Leanne will take you through that uh, step by step and really break that down and, and explain it she explains all the te terminology and um, a little bit of a jargon buster if you like so I know there's so yeah. many sort of words and phrases we use and if you're new to colouring it can sometimes be a little bit of a, of a puzzle to work out exactly what we're talking about but Leanne will guide you through all that terminology as part of those classes. Then we've moved on to TN3 which is our next uh, colour up so a little bit darker. We're making sure we don't go over all of that TN1 uh, but again we're using that same technique of flicking inwards still making sure we have um, preserved that highlight into the centre. And what we're thinking is it's going to be a little bit darker, of course, under where his little ears are because they're going to be casting a shadow onto his fur underneath. It's going to be a little bit darker at the edges as well because we're going to have that roundness, that sort of bevel uh, to his, his little tummy there. So we're going to add that darker tone just around the edges and once again, that same technique of flicking upwards and downwards to start to bring that texture of fur into play to make it look more realistic. Then finally, all we need to do is bring in TN6, our tan colour way that that darkest of our four pen blend and let's just start to add this at the very edges to bring in the darkest areas 
of this part of our, um, our lovely image. And what yet. I love about this as well, I know you showed it briefly with the stamps, but you do have the, these lovely images to colour in. So, you know, great for practising in, but actually, you know, down the line, these are going to be great images that you can use for your projects. But mm. on that first sheet of stamps, people might get a bit confused and go, why have I got a triangle to cover, mm -hmm. colour in? Why have I got a prism to colour in? And, and those are, again, all there because... Leanne uses those, doesn't she, in the tutorials to show you how to do the, the, the light and shade on the, the different shapes, which then I suppose will help you then when you go into colouring things that you're doing here, like, you know, mm. animals and objects and all these kind of things. Absolutely. All it is about is, is mastering to the uh, techniques of colouring different shapes. And then once you've applied that and mastered that technique, apply that to different images. So then you start to break down your images and you start to see them as different shapes. So the reason why we've included all of those different shape stamps is that Leanne will teach you how to colour, for example, a sphere, a cylinder. So once you've mastered those techniques, then bring in the other stamps within the collection, or even as you progress those skills a little bit more, bring in other stamps that you've got within your own collection, and you can start to apply those those different techniques of colouring those uh, specific shapes and you can start to colour pretty much anything once you've learned those basic techniques which I think is amazing because it allows mm. you to apply that knowledge so maybe you're going to start off with just the shapes then you're going to move on to the images as part of the collection then start to look in your craft stash and apply those techniques elsewhere and then you really will be away and, and literally everything that you have there is everything that she uses so again you don't have to sort of go scouting around your craft room mm. to find other pens or other stamps, Absolutely. it's all in the box, isn't it? Yeah, the only thing that I've used here that's different is, of course, you're going to need some sort of stamp platform, but yep. of course, as always, you'll find those on the website and an ink pad. That yeah. is literally it, because your card stock's within the collection, all of the pens that I'm using are part of that uh, box as well, and then, of course, that beautiful stamp is also included, uh, which I think is amazing. To get everything included, pretty much, is outstanding. It just means that if you are a beginner, you're not having to uh, spend an awful lot more to get a lot of extra items. You can literally be pretty much crafting straight out of that box, which I think is amazing. So you can see there how quick and easy that was to start to build up your texture, build up your light and shade onto that image. And all we do is we continue repeating that technique all over uh -huh. our image. Look at him. Isn't so he just cute. the cutest? Absolutely love him. You'll notice as well, just so I move this away, that I did have a piece uh, of scrap paper underneath where I was working. It's always best practice to try and include that because that's going to mean that uh, your ink, because you will find your ink goes through to the other side, and that's totally normal, that's perfect, that's what you want to see. It means that the ink is moving within the fibres of the card. If you don't have your card underneath and you've got something non-porous, like a glass mat, it can potentially, because it's got nowhere to go, it's got nothing to soak into underneath, it can potentially be sucked back up onto the front side of that card. You can then potentially get bleeding outside your lines. Mm. By having that cardstock underneath, it means that the ink's got somewhere to go. So as it bleeds through to the other side of the piece you're colouring onto, then it can bleed into that cardstock underneath underneath that porous surface if it needs to, rather than being sucked back up into your artwork. So that's our beautiful little, um, little doggy all coloured in. We've got a couple of die cut ovals and we're going to start to layer this into uh, a card. We're going to create a cute little card, bring in some of our uh, lovely papers that we've got on the show as well. And we're going to start to build this all together with a focus on this lovely coloured image. So what we're going to do is give them a little bit of shape, just literally using my uh, pokey tool. Nothing difficult, nothing technical about that, but I think it makes a... Um, a nice little difference to have a little bit of dimension onto there. And to make sure we're keeping that dimension as we stick that down, let's pop some foam tape on the back there, of course. It would be ideal to be cutting down some of those uh, A4 foam sheets that I know have been proven so, so popular today. Quite frankly, I can see why at that price, amazing value on those foam sheets. Okay. Let's pop them onto the centre. Then we're just going to layer up quite a simple card base. So what we've taken is we've taken some of those lovely uh, Ditsy Floral Ultimate Papers that we've got uh, as part of the show today. It does help if you take the lid off your glue, Lily. Take your lid now. off your glue, Lily. You what you silly like. Billy. What Honestly. Like? Oh, um, dear, oh, dear. By the way, just I, I realise it's ages since I did that Christmas question. Oh, yeah, how are we getting on? Everybody um, got it right? Well, I don't think... Well, well, when making mince pies, which way should you stir your mince meat for good luck? Uh, it's actually clockwise. I've seen a few anti-clockwises. It's clockwise is the answer. That's, um, I'll have to say I went for anti-clockwise. I didn't because, know, but I guessed anti, but no. Because when you're stirring normally, you stir anti-clockwise, don't you? To I be do. honest, I've never well, thought you about th it. Think about it. Imagine you've got a whiskey in your hand. You, clockwise. You go clockwise? You go that way, so. do you? I think so. I always go anti-clockwise. I think I do, but now I'm thinking about it, I'm like, do I? I'm going to have to go and do some whiskey now just to, to find out. Anyway, the answer is clockwise. If you said clockwise, well done. Uh, Lily was right as well, says Jen. Sweater comes from sweat. There we go. 
Um, and <laughs> and Jen says jumpers is derived for noun derived from the noun jump, modified for French jupe, used to mean short coat. Blimey, eh? Well, never I knew that. never knew that. Um, Caroline Hanley saying Ben, the digital Ben, certainly is a helpful chap, much more helpful than the the real one. Um, oh. I'm Nicola. That's very rude, Nicola. Nicola just said she finds digital Ben really annoying. At least she didn't say, I find real Ben really annoying. Yeah, that'd be even maybe worse. that was the next line, who knows. How Controversial. dare you. Controversial. How dare you, Nicola, and I grew a moustache for you and everything during November, and that's all I get. Um, and Betty says, and Ben, don't forget, all family members should take a turn stirring the mincemeat and make a wish whilst oh. taking their turn. Oh, that's nice. Make nice a little, little Christmas idea. wish. Um, Stephanie says, I've just bought, I have bought this just for the consumables. I don't blame you. Do not blame you at all. It, it, that price is still a heck of a price for the consumables alone, isn't it? Let's be honest. Absolutely, it is. Amazing price. Stephanie also says, how many rooms do you have, Lily? Uh, <laughs> how many rooms that are not craft rooms? Yeah, be more to the point. none. Uh, so the rooms that have no craft in them are my two bathrooms and my kitchen and my bedroom, actually. That doesn't have any craft in. Uh, but I've got two official craft rooms. So I've got one where I kind of work, so I'll sit in that room. It's where I've got my desk and all my sort of most essential crafty goodies, I suppose you could say. Uh, and then I've got my craft room number two, as I call it, which <laughs> is mainly storage. Uh, so I've got shelving and stuff uh, and bookcases and lots of storage in there. And then my living room downstairs, I have to say, there is a little corner that's got a bookshelf uh, that's full of craft. And that bookshelf, I have to say, it looks beautiful because it's where I put a lot of my uh, box kits. So like my Academy of Colour is all stacked up along there. I've got some of my Spectrum Noir kits on there. So that's kind of like my box shelf, if you like, which okay. I think, think is fabulous. So technically two. Uh, two and a bit, maybe, if we're, if we're being honest. Do, do you know what the brilliant thing is now as well? I can see everybody at home now t trying to work out which way they, they stir. Whiz. Betty's just said, I always stir clockwise. That feels weird to me. I'm I, not sure whether I stir in one direction or whether I stir in several. I don't know. I definitely go anti-clockwise. I don't know. Clockwise yeah. is... We'll do another question in a bit, by the way. Um, M. R. Simmons says, Lily, how do you keep your nails so nice and free of chips? They're so festive and really add to your lovely demos. Oh, because uh, I've not done them myself. They're being done at the salon, so mm. they don't, the colour doesn't come off. Luckily, otherwise, given the amount of backings I peel off foam tape, they'd be a right mess otherwise, wouldn't they? Well, well. Uh, but no, I get them done, I have to say. I don't, don't do my own nails. Um, and she also goes on to say, got this box when it, come, when it first came out at HSN for over 100 bucks. Mm -hmm. What value today? It's, the, it's well. It's the deal of the day, isn't it? It's got to be, surely. It's amazing value. I mean, I got mine at uh, that launch price as well, which is around about uh, just over, uh, just under 150 quid when it launched. Yeah. And I was delighted at that price because the value you are getting is amazing to get all that education as well. But uh, to get it at that amazing price today, oh my God, goodness me, I cannot believe that price. Incredible. Get it while you can. Yeah. Absolutely. So just to finish this off, we're going to pop a uh, little sentiment on there. Nice, simple design, but it's all about that colouring. It's all about that beautiful stamp and your fantastic Academy of Colour. So all we're going to do is just finish that off with that top left-hand corner with our little sentiment with love. Absolutely adore that little doggy. I think he is just adorable. Yeah. Fantastic coloured in using your uh, beautiful Academy of Colour and then bringing in your ditzy floral uh, papers into the background as well. The gold card that we went for was also that glittering gold 12 by 12 inch Mitch card pad. I think we might have a deal on that one as well. So do check the website out for that fantastic paper pad. What a beautiful project. We'll, in the um, next hour of the show, we'll also do the vote for the demo of the show slot. Oh, no, that would be the demo, because we're doing one, demo of the day. Because um, I would imagine later on, we probably won't be doing any more demos. But listen, this is a great opportunity. Let me know if you picked this up today. Maybe you are someone like um, Stephanie, who's going, you know what, I'll have another one of those Academy of Colours, because I just want to uh, make sure I've got more of the consumable elements of it. It is a steal today. It is uh, 39.99, 49.99. If you're a, um, if you're just buying it, you know, you're just coming in and buying it today. If you are just coming in, by the way, make sure you join the club and you'll get the 20% uh, off as your first purchase. 31.99 or 39.99. And here's the other brilliant thing. This price is amazing, but then you're thinking, oh, well, I'm missing out on all the points I would have got. No, you're not, because you're getting triple points what? on that. So in effect, you're still going to get ooh, what, 96 points as well, right. 120 points uh, if you're shopping in the US. So many, many reasons to jump in and grab. And of course, you've got your um, free shipping incentives as well. So do make sure you pick up the deals, grab them whilst you can, because uh, things are selling 
fast. If you've just joined us, the, the first hour of that show has flown over. I've got to tell you, it is our Crafters TV, Crafters Christmas shopping day. It's the, it's the last day, really. If you're looking to get a Christmas gift for somebody and you want to ensure that it is nestled nicely under the Christmas tree, you need to be ordering today. Um, it, it's your best last chance today, really. We, I, I can't use the word, we're going to guarantee it, because uh, we can't, you know, because there are other elements that obviously, you know, we have to factor in. But if you buy today, it is your best chance to make sure that you get that Christmas gift nestled under the tree this Christmas time. So buy today. And the other reasons you'll buy today, of course, as well as we've just discussed, are that um, free shipping here in the UK, free shipping up until Monday, the 18th of December. If you're in the US, uh, it's now just a threshold of $50. So $50 spend gets you your free shipping if you're shopping in the eu just 20 euros will get you your free shipping and like we said so that all runs up until monday the triple point is up until midnight tonight wherever you are so there's lots of reasons to be shopping today yes the deals are fantastic but you've also got those sort of added extras thrown in as well uh ronda says i have a paper craft room and a sewing craft room like that um and lots of love. Yeah, actually, that's a good point. Rhonda, we thought that, because we've seen, been, been with you um, on Craft Alongs, and we thought you had like a sewing basement. But maybe that is it, isn't it? The sewing, sewing craft room is the, but if, yeah, well, it still be big. It'd be a big, big sewing basement. Um, I'm gonna look at some card in a minute. Can I fire another Christmas quiz question at you then? This one we didn't do in the quiz because I wrote 10 questions for each round, but we ended up only doing five. We did a Christmas quiz, by the way, if you're just joining us um, in the office in between shows. I've been non-stop today. I haven't sat down all day. Oh, what a day I've had, always on the go. How I get my work done, no one seems to know. But I'm always feeling happy. I'm never feeling sad. At the end of the day, you'll hear me say, I'm all of a fluster, where's my duster? Oh, what a day I've had. Um, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> went a bit panto for you there. So uh, this question we didn't do in the quiz, just for a bit of fun, playing along on the socials. It's a good one, this. I, I read it in um, one of the tabloids, so it must be true. What, dire what direction, that's a wrong question. What decoration will you not find on King Charles's Christmas tree? And I'll give you a multiple choice here. There's something he doesn't want on his Christmas tree. I didn't read the article all the way through to find out why, but I know what it is. Is it tinsel? Is it baubles, ornaments? Or is it an angel on the top? So what decoration won't you find on King Charles's Christmas trees? Tinsel, baubles, ornaments, or an angel on the top? That's your next question. Have a think about that and we'll do the answer in about five minutes. That gives me a good point as well, actually a good other question, not a quiz question. Huh? What do you have on top of your Christmas tree? Who, me? Everyone. Everyone. Because I was always led to believe it was either a star or it was an angel. Then I saw a photo of Craig's Christmas tree the other day, there's a Santa on top. I thought, well, what's that all about? Is it actually? Santa, yeah. Like a Santa. I'm like, no, it's either I... an angel or it's a star. I did not so notice that. Be... I've got a carrot on top of mine. A carrot? No, I haven't. Um... I'm going to say. <laughs> I was going to say, I thought Santa was bad enough, but a carrot, <laughs> no. As much as I love my carrots, I'm not having a carrot on my Christmas tree. Uh, star, we've got. Star, yeah. interesting. And it is it always my job to put the, the, the star tall on the one, top. yeah, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. so, uh, I'm, uh, anything I'm really allowed to do, actually. So it's a bit like <laughs> when we decorate with the kids, um, Laura likes to have it all sort of just so. So I put a few bits up, then she just moves it around anyway, so. At least you have one job, put yeah. the star on. That's the it. crowning glory, it's the key job. Yeah. Without that, it wouldn't be a complete Christmas tree. So there, That's you it. are vital to that decorating And I process. do trim the tree as well. I do oh. trim it. I do the trimming oh. and then trim up the top as well to make it's sure it fits. Done. So it's an important job. Very important. Um, but yeah, so there you go. So what's the answer to that decoration, what you won't find on King Charles's Christmas tree? And also, what do you have on yours? Is it angel? Is it star? Or, or is it Santa? Or have you gone rogue? Yeah. Or have you gone rogue and anything. put something random on there? Carrot, maybe. Mm. Now... We're going to, whilst we're waiting for those answers to come in, we're going to play a fun game with Lily oh. once again. It's round two of do, 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 Play do. Your Craft Card Right. We've got a selection of card that is in a three for two over on the website. Uh, and it's all very, very busy. All oh, really, 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 really busy. However, we want you to pick your, what are we saying now? The top four. Top four? It's got easier, has it? Yeah. Wow. However, I know we did the top three earlier on. Yeah. It might have changed. It might so have So there'll, there'll be one new one. Mm-hmm. 
but the other three might have changed. Yep. Okay. All right. So am I going to go through them all? Okay. So fairly swiftly, because otherwise we'll be, we'll, we'll be here till Christmas. I can remember what's there, Nicola. Don't you worry. So um, all of these are on a three for two. One of my favourite paper pads of the year is the Venetian Grace because it comes from one of my favourite collections from one of my favourite cities in the whole world. Uh, beautifully, beautifully um, done this. You've got so many different layers of design within each of the sheets. Beautiful florals, beautiful scenery, uh, beautiful architecture. Uh, it is a stunning pad for 11 99 or 15 96 And let me just explain. I'll, I'll show you um, the majority of what we've got in the three for two. If you want, you can have three of the Venetian Grace pads in your basket and you'll only pay for two, or you can mix and match across the range. It's entirely up to you. So that's the first one. Uh, do you want to put that in the maybe pile or in the no pile? Maybe. Maybe. They're all going to go in the maybe, aren't they? Yes, Nicola, I probably am going to maybe all of them, yeah. Um, <laughs> next up. Neon Dreams. The Neon Dreams is this beautiful, so this is 300 GSM, much more of a card pad than a paper pad, really, on this beautiful pearl cardstock. Look at that. Um, mm -hmm. the, I just think the sheen and the shine that you get off this cardstock is incredible. And I know I'm highlighting more the B side here because that is mine, along with yours mm. on a boat that we did favourite. And you're the same, aren't you, with Absolutely, this pad? Absolutely, yeah. Love this paper pad. Love the B side because it reminds, reminds me of almost like oil on water. Yeah. It's amazing. Look at that. Look at the colours there. Absolutely <gasps> incredible. incredible. It's kind of like um, disco animal print that you've got disco, going disco, on, isn't disco. it? Disco, disco, disco. Disco, disco. And then on the reverse, like you say, that marbled sort of mm. oil on water effect. There's your volcanic lava. Oh, yeah. Um, what are you thinking? Is that in the top? Yeah, that's got to be 100%. You, definite that one. So that's in the definite. Definite, maybe. Mm -hmm. So um, next up, sort of from your core range of Centura Pearl colours, same price on these. So we'll pop up the details for the baby pink. Do, 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 do. £3.19 or £5.59. Baby Pearl. Baby Pearl. Baby, baby pink. Pearl. It's a new colour. Coming soon to 2024, Baby Pearl, Centura Pearl, <laughs> the new colourway. <laughs> there you go. I'm now a voiceover as well. I love it. You, you seem to be redundant. At least you can put the star on top of a tree. Doing Still it all. Still got one job. <laughs> why um, not, eh? It's uh, for a penny and for a pound. Look at Rudolph having a look, by the way. Ready? <laughs> watch, watch, watch. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> um, sorry. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, £3.19, £5.59, either or. Are those going to be in the top, do you think? No. No, you don't think. Okay, so no. that, they're in the no pile. Controversial. And what I would also say is, I don't want to tell you how to shop. If, you, if, you, if you're getting a three for two, if you're, getting, if you're getting three lots of those, then fine. But don't go, don't go two of those and then one of those, because then you're wasting, mm. you're wasting your, your, your freebie. Just, I mean, you knew that anyway. You didn't need me to say that. Next up, Snow White, fitting very nicely at Christmas time. Uh, this is your Snow White, hint of gold. 50 sheets you're getting here. I know you used this this morning, didn't you? And I've just realised it was in that last demonstration as well. I made my card base from it and the oval that I die cut, that was also Centura Pearl. Okay. Uh huh. It's going to go in the top. Top four or whatever would you reckon it's going to the top four? I think so. It, it's got yeah, it. it's a bit of a craft room staple, this oh, it's isn't amazing, it? Amazing, is it? Yeah, love the fact that it's super classy. You've got that really subtle hint of gold on mm. there. It's not brass, it's not really in your face, but you've got that lovely subtle hint. Amazing if you're wedding stationery. I'm thinking if you are doing wedding invites, maybe think about getting three of those stock up while you can. Yeah, nothing to stop you from going a three for two on that and then mixing and matching your others. Um, so we're putting that on the definite pile. Bella Luna. Um, luxury linen cardstock. I know linen cardstock has been so super popular, certainly that the latter half of this year. And you'll find in the majority of the collections that we do now, uh, you're finding a set of our beautiful linen cardstock to match up with the papers and the vellums as well. Um, within this, you're getting eight colours, three of each. What are you thinking here, Lily? Obviously, the Bella Luna, a much loved collection. Mm. Lovely, lovely colour palette of um, linen cardstock. Used it in Denver of the show this morning as well. What are you thinking? I'm going to go no. Oh! I'm trying to be ruthless here because, quite frankly, I could I could say yes to all of them because they're all amazing. They're all outstanding value for money. But mm, what's it going to be? What's going to be in that top four? It's literally down to you guys at home. Whatever you're shopping for the most, it's going to be in that top four. But what will it be? 
Will it be this one? Also By the time we've done this, it's taken us a while. The top four will probably change. Probably us, yeah. Uh, That'll be my excuse when I get it all Yeah. Done. Uh, it was, but it's not anymore. Yeah, there um, we go. Precious Golds, 36 sheets, uh, four colour pack here. So everything you love about your Centura Pearl, but in all of these metallic colours. Uh, A4 again, 310 GSM. What are you thinking here? Mm. Look at the look at the shine you get off I the know, metallic. Amazing, it's aren't so they? good. Has this kind of barged its way into the top four? Do you think? I'm going to say no. Oh, okay. But I'm probably wrong. Who knows? Do you want to put it in the maybe pile? No. <laughs> I'm trying to be ruthless here. I'm trying. You sure? You sure? It looks marvellous, though, doesn't I it? I feel I'm being hoodwinked here, so I'm going to say no. no. Okay. You're not going to convince me. I feel like I'm on one of those uh, quiz shows back in the day when, you, when the presenter used to try and. Uh, oh yeah, take the money. Right, take Open the, the box. Yeah. No, okay, no, don't make me. Don't convince me. Nine fifty nine or eleven ninety nine for that. Amazing. Um, wildflowers. Now the wildflowers earlier on was in our top three. Is it still in the top four? Do we reckon? Such a different um, paper pad this, isn't it? Because we do lots of kind of like your standard florals, but I think one of the first times we've done like a wildflowers collection. I yeah. think that's why it was so popular. Yeah, definitely. I mean, we do a lot of florals, like we say, but there's something different about this one. There's something a little bit more rustic, if you want mm. it to be. It can also be quite masculine, ideal for those masculine makes as well. But I love the fact that you've got all those extra little details. So you'll see on some of those sheets, you've got the gorgeous little bumblebees, which are adorable. Yeah, they're cute. You fussy cut those out. You've got your butterfly details, and I love love the b-side on this pad i was saying actually on this morning's uh, wake up call i've actually used some of the b-side designs for christmas cards oh yeah who would have thought it uh, it just goes to show how versatile this paper pad is love that i mean wouldn't that be amazing as a wallpaper oh yes i know yeah would love you'd that. need to buy a few a few of these well, pads to do your well, walls yeah. though we might have to try and uh, convince leanne to branch out into wallpaper. into wallpaper yeah, you must I'd know somebody know. does wallpaper around here surely um, what are you thinking? The it's got to be. Yeah. You're getting that in the top, in the top four. four? Surely. All right. Look at those designs. Look at the pink on that. Oh, beautiful. $11.99 or $15.99 if you're platinum. The precious metals. Precious gold. We've done that one. Precious metals. Okay. It's not uh -oh. the precious gold, the precious uh, luxury card stock is not in the. No, it's there, that's right. Luxury card stock. Yep, that's, that's it. That's the right one. That's the fella. That's the, that's the one. I've given you the answer already here. Um, we, we've got an open one of these somewhere. I, I don't want to open this one because we had this yesterday. I'll get it for the next show. But in here, you've got uh, 40 sheets of these beautiful colours in uh, our, our stunning glitter card stock. So, non shed glitter card. Still get all of the sparkle, but without any of the faff and the fuss. You're getting. Um, Sheets of our matte mirror, beautiful. Some of you call it like satin mirror, but a really, really classy um, kind of metallic look alongside our super shiny, super sheeny mirror card. And you'll also get uh, 10 sheets of our adhesive um, glitter papers, which are just absolutely brilliant. And again, um, stickable, die cuttable as well, those, oh, aren't yeah, they? Oh yeah, absolutely. I have to say, I only discovered this pack of card a few, uh, probably a few months ago now. Yeah. But it's firm becoming one of my firm favorites. I love the fact that you can die cut it. I love the fact that you've got all those different finishes. Super luxurious looking, but honestly, that is not a luxurious price tag. Let's be it's honest, not, amazing. It's a very affordable mm. price tag. Uh, I've given you the answer. It's not in the top four, but it's proving very popular. 10.39 or 11.96 on that is your platinum price. Mix and match these around. Mm -hmm. uh, do not miss out. Um, we've then got Ditsy Florals has been super popular recently alongside the botanic garden uh, and our um, beautiful pearl rainbow pad as well beautiful designs of your florals one side as we discussed earlier this one's quite nice for the fact that you've got um a lot of kind of uh, shapes and designs on the other side which would be great for more sort of masculine cards potentially mm, definitely absolutely love this paper pad that design there you can just see with the stripes that's one we used in that previous demonstration that we've just done beautiful paper pad but like mm. ben i absolutely adore the fact that the reverse is a little bit more geometric on some of those yeah uh, so ideal for your gents cars as well as your more fe feminine makes as well that red orangey red is absolutely beautiful look at all that and you've got that pearlized finish on each and every single sheet double-sided pearlized finish as well great for your construction projects too with it being heavyweight i know mm. we call it paper but it's not a paper it's, not. it's a car pad in 250. reality 250 gsm beautiful love that one rudolph likes it he does got to be in the top four surely. that's in your top four it's got to be. so well i'll show you the last two but from what you're saying is uh the fuchsias that we've got here will not be going into 
the top four as much as they have been very, very popular indeed. What's good about this though, again, is the fact that if you love the Fuchsia collection, you can pick this up, your um, 12 by 12, and we've also got the fabulous Fuchsia in the luxury linen card stock as well. So you've got the matching linen card stock to go with the beautiful um, 12 by 12 pad that I'm showing you here. Once again, it's all been done for you. Beautiful color palette, matching um, B side to your A side, and you're getting all of that 36 sheets for just 11.99 or 15.99. And then if you want to pick up your um, linen card stock as well, you can, all matching up beautifully. You're getting slightly different in this one, actually, 25 sheets this time around, you're getting those five different colors, five sheets of each. Um, and the price on that one we will get for you in just a mo, or maybe we won't, but it's on the three for two anyway. Um, that's not it, that's not it, but never mind. Check it out, it's on the website. Everything we've just shown you there is in the three for two. Three of these for the price of two. Mix and match on the three for two. It's entirely up to you how you do it. So Lily's top four so far today, she's gone Ditsy Floral, Wildflower, Snow White, Centura Pearl, Hint of Gold, and Neon Dreams. Mm -hmm. I can tell you out of four, you've got mm -hmm. four. Really? Four out of four. Wow. That's your top four right there. Ooh, there you go. If only it was quite as good as a quiz this afternoon, but uh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> at least I won at something. Yeah. It's funny enough, the next round we would have done was uh, all about our card stuff. We didn't have time Can to do it. Can you imagine if, I, if that would have been, I would have been straight up there. 100%. Yeah. I know the answers. No, uh, miss, I know, I know. Miss. Um, all of those are in the three for two. So uh, crack on, help yourselves, don't miss out. You've got that shipping incentive. You've also got your triple points. So there's no better time to jump in and take advantage of that deal. Um, few, oh, loads of comments coming through here. Um, Kirsty D says, Academy of Colour ordered for my niece. No wonder I'm the favourite auntie. Mm -hmm. Way to do it. Um, yes, Rhonda's got a sewing basement. And as far as the, <laughs> as far as the, um, what doesn't go on, Charles's tree. Shell says, is it tinsel? Probably the angel says Phil. Tinsel says Mary. Uh, angel says Dale. Uh, I think King Charles hates tinsel, says Shadiah. Uh, hope it's tinsel. I just like them too, says Carleen. I can tell you the answer is tinsel. Ooh, he doesn't have tinsel on his trees, apparently. Yeah. No, ah. tinsel is the answer. Um, and Rachel, who says, I don't know if I'm supposed to read this out. Uh, I'm going to read it. Oh, blimey. I think, uh -oh. I think I'm allowed to, aren't I, Rachel? Yeah. Am I? Just let me know very quickly. Uh, M.R. Simmons says, I love the US free $50 spend. I don't have to worry about items selling out that I want. Thank you so much, CC. Um, and Jennifer Joseph says, can we see what is in the Christmas stockings? We will have another revisit of the stockings um, a little bit later on. Um, I'm going to, no, I'm going to read out Rachel's comment. She says, I'm weird. Oh. Not you're me. In right, you're in the right place. Yeah. Yeah, you fit in very well. <laughs> I have a felt cat ornament at the top in place of a star or angel that looks like one of my previous um, pets. And I've, got, and I've got a felt Scotty dog at the bottom, so it looks like the dog chased the cat up the tree. Brilliant. That is clever. That is. I mean, that is right up my street, that one. We need a picture of that, please. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Thank you. Uh, let us have a look at some £10, $10 deals with Lily. These are unbelievable deals. And by the way, that 10 is before your Club Inspire discount, isn't it? Absolutely. So it gets even better if you're part of our uh, Platinum Club. This one is going to come all the way down to £8 or $8. Given that this monthly craft kit is worth... Oh, we're not doing the craft kit first. Ooh. Oh. Leave, we're saving that for just a saving moment. Saving that. Ooh. Okie doke, we have got something else that's still an amazing price at £8 or $8 because it's going to be under £10 to get all three of these massive pots of Gilding Flakes home to you guys. These are amazing. This is our patina pack. You've got your sun glow, your rich copper and your verdigris. All three different colourways, absolutely beautiful gilding weights. So gilding flakes even. Of course, you can stamp with these using your gilding flake glue. You can use your self-adhesive sheets, those double-sided foam sheets that we've got. You can use those alongside these, but it's going to give your mates that really expensive, really luxurious look and feel. 
I mean, uh, quite a few companies do do the uh, do 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 do, do, do. Gilding, gilding flakes, but it's very rare that you see colours other other than your golds and your silvers and maybe your bronze. So to get that beautiful green included as well is absolutely fantastic. Just eight pounds or eight dollars if you are part of our platinum club. Absolutely fantastic set of gilding flakes. Mm. I love those ones. Absolutely brilliant. Sorry, <laughs> I thought you were going to carry on. I was just looking at my next quiz question. Ben, you're here to talk about craft, and the craft is Christmas Day. Um, sorry, everybody. We are going to have a look next at the deal which Lily was going to bring to you a few moments ago, which has been very busy. One of, if not the lowest price I have ever seen on one of our monthly craft kits. I mean, this doesn't even cover the consumables in the box, Lily, does it? It can't, can it? Let's be honest. We always say $24.99 is an amazing price when it's at full price given the amount of goodies that you get within these boxes. But so to get it down to eight pound or eight dollars is absolutely incredible. So this is your one of your monthly craft kits. This is all about creating your pop out scene cards. A little bit of inspiration down in the front. You can see the sorts of cards that you can actually be creating. Within this box, you're getting two sets of metal dies, 10 clear stamps, 24 card blanks with matching envelopes. There's nine assorted ribbons, 15 sheets of your colored card, 18 sheets of your printed paper and 100 pearls. But let's have a look at yeah. all these amazing goodies. You're getting over 200 elements included as part of this box. Box is also included as well, so great for storage, great for presentation if you are gifting this as well. It's going to be ideal for newbies to craft in. First up, you, you open up your box and you've got that message from Sarah, also including a link to our website where you can see all the inspiration when it comes to this fantastic box. Everything is wrapped in that quality tissue paper as well, so again, making it ideal gift. First up, let's have a little look at two of our die sets. These are the die sets that will cut into your cardstock, those beautiful uh, scenes that allow you to create those pop art elements on the inside of your cards. You've got your gorgeous uh, birthday party scene there, and you've also got your indoor woodland, uh, outdoor even, indoor woodland. What's indoor outdoor? woodland? An indoor woodland. Mm, Be interesting, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would. This mm. one's an outdoor woodland. Yeah. Though. Uh, this is what we used in that first demonstration this morning. So you get those included in die form, a few accessory dies in there as well. Then let's have a little look at our stamps. You are getting lots of sentiment stamps included as part of this collection and things that will match with the imagery that we've got within the dies as well. You've got things like I believe in you and leave a little sparkle wherever you go. And you do also have those accessory stamps that match with the dies as well. Then we come on to the next of the two stamp sets. So it's like there's a stamp set to match each die set as well, which is fantastic. And then, of course, you're getting all of your ribbons. So you're getting three different colorways, three different widths of each of those, making nine ribbons. And you also get 100 pearls in three different colorways, again, three different sizes that will match alongside those ribbons. Then we come on to 18 sheets of our beautiful pattern paper. Really nice color tones on here. You've got things like your mustards, you've got your navies, you've got that slightly off-white for that really nice rustic feel. Beautiful papers and they're going to be great as well for some of those masculine makes. And then alongside your pattern papers, you've got the solid colours of cardstock, 15 sheets of those to match perfectly. And again, the colours are all going to tie together, whether it's the papers, the card, or your fantastic embellishments as well. Then the crowning glory is that you get 24 card blanks with your matching envelopes as well. So if you are crafting straight out of the box, you've got something that's good to go to create cards straight away. If you're new to crafting, what an amazing gift to get all of those goodies yeah. in this fantastic quality box, storage box as well, that you can keep everything safely housed within for eight pound or eight dollars is an absolute steal of deal. Even if you've already got one of these kits, definitely worthwhile picking this up just for the consumables because those papers, those embellishments are absolutely gorgeous. £8 or $8 for that absolute beauty. It is one of the best deals on the show, honestly. £25, $25 is incredible. £8, $8. Almost laughable. And I know a lot of people will be buying, it might be you, picking up another one of those boxes just for the consumables alone, but a perfect gift idea as well. Also proved very popular today. We did see these in action a little bit earlier on a wake up call. The um, flower forming tools, Lily, have been very popular today. Can see why at that price. Yeah. Amazing. Great stocking filly. If you are thinking about getting into your flower making, your flower forming, then this is one you absolutely need within your crafty kit. This is a four piece collection. It's coming to you for just £8, $8.00 that amazing platinum club price you're saving over 30 percent before you even take into account that platinum club saving so great value on this one not only are you getting that uh, foam mat and that's a perfect density for doing all your shaping techniques onto but you're also getting three double-ended ball tools range of different sizes of the balls on there nice uh, easy grip handle onto your ball tool as well so you're gonna oh there you go they're gonna fit to, just to make sure you're awake then i was awake Ooh, didn't scare me at all now 
Gave yourself a heart attack too. Uh, <laughs> you can tell the metal, nice quality ball tools, and you've got that lovely grip handle onto those tools as well. Tells you on the back all the different sizes that you've got of those ball tools, taking all the way from that really small ball on that smallest one, right the way up to that great big ball, great for creating large flowers for your home decor projects. Four piece collection, amazing price on those. Of course, using your paper, your card, your foam as well, not just for one sort of material. Absolutely fantastic value. Eight pounds, eight dollars. Incredible. Next. Again, uh, huge value for money there. 40 99 90 99 Not today. Pick these up whilst you can. Uh, triple points and, of course, those free shipping incentives as well. And one final deal that you'll need to get because this is a snip. Oh. The scissors. Absolutely. Do you know what? I was ready, ready and poised to use that joke and he got in before Oh, me. I'm sorry. You have to be quick round here with the jokes, that's for sure. You do. But th this deal is absolutely amazing. This is a pair of your nine inch straight scissors for just £8.8. .8. It should be $15.99 or $24.99. These are the big daddies. These are the biggest scissors that we do. These are going to be ideal for cutting your fabric as well as your paper and your card. You've even got all of the measurements alongside the blade there, which allows you to cut with complete and utter precision. You've got that easy grip handle there which means the larger side is going to allow you to fit your fingers through and you've got the other side for your thumbs. It's super, super sharp blades onto there. You've got fantastic quality blades allowing you to cut through all of those maybe trickier materials with absolute ease, with absolute precision. It's one of those you have to have in your crafty stash or also with them being the larger size, they're also ideal to be having around the home uh, for perhaps opening boxes, especially at Christmas time, for tasks in the kitchen as well. So it's not one of those that you sort of buy one pair. I'd say one pair in the kitchen, maybe one pair in your craft room, uh, one pair in your living room. Uh, of course, lots of options with these besides your crafting. But for £8.8, .8, definitely one to be adding to those baskets and checking them out and see why they've been so popular today. Um, Rachel Jones says, I promoted my daughter to putting the topper on the tree this year. It is the most important job. It is. We now have Winnie the Pooh holding a star. Oh, cute. It's a very like Disney that. themed tree. I do love that idea. Um, a lot of other brands have their versions of ball tools, says Nikoni on YouTube, but the CC ones have a good variety of sizes covered and I love them. Uh, and Evelyn says, Tintal was my favourite part of decorating the tree when I was a kid. Uh, keep the lovely comments coming through. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We are going to um, have a look at a little video here because proving still ever so popular is the Pro Sketch Pack. It's so super popular. And I think it's worth just having a look at this again. And also worth you getting it today if you want to um, have the best chance of this being nestled under the Christmas tree this year. We're saying that today, we can't obviously guarantee that if you buy today, it's gonna to be there, but we're saying you've got the best chance if you shop with us today. Other factors come into play that we obviously can't control, but it's the best chance today to get these deals. It's the best chance because you're gonna get triple points. It's the best chance because you've got those um, postage incentives as well. And this has just been such a, a huge, huge item for many people over the course of the last few weeks. Everything that you need to get started with your sketching, uh, everything that you need to potentially carry on your journey. Um, the value for money, as you'll hear from Sheena in this clip, is absolutely incredible. And she'll take you through everything that you're going to get within the box too. Also worth bearing in mind that you do get a full instruction booklet as well. So you have uh, plenty to go at. This is a, a box I think that everybody will love, whether you're seven or 77 whether you've sketched or never sketched before this is one of the best deals i think that we've had um certainly this half of the year it's incredible the pro sketch pack limited edition 31.99 $39.96 half price held the price from when we launched it here on crafters tv about three weeks ago and here's a little video of um, sheena taking you all around it and as i always say have a listen to all of the goodies that you get in here. And also when Sheena talks about the value for money that you're getting, and it will make you realize just how crazy that price is there at the bottom of the screen. And also bear in mind, which you didn't get when we launched it three weeks ago, you will get triple points on this as well. So have a listen, here's Sheena. We'll catch you the other side of this. It is phenomenal. So uh, seriously, if there's somebody who's of school age, uh, college, anybody and just this they're going to want to use this but you're going to want to use this as well shall i take you through what's in um yeah. on the overhead yeah, right let's look at it and then i've got mine already set up this is what you get the first layer right so this is the first layer we have a huge pencil like this this is called a, a clutch pencil or a lead holder 
Look at the size of, look at, look at that, look at that mm. lead, that's all lead. So that's for your sketching, for okay. your shading. We'll be using that today. I'll be taking you through that. And to pop it back in, you just do that and it goes back. But you've also got in there, you have got, I'm just gonna do, instead of like an order, I'm gonna go around. You've got a okay. mechanical pencil here, oh, yeah. down here. You've got your regular mechanical pencil that you probably know about. Now, I've got to say guys, with these two here, I've paid up to 10 pounds for what my, my uh, clutch holder, um, my pencil, so um, five to six pounds for an inexpensive one. Right, okay. The value is I have everything that's in here, just say it, and I've paid a lot of money for everything that's in here. So they're the first two, but you also get refills for these guys. So you get a whole pack here. It's, it's hard to get them out here. I'm gonna do my best to get them out because I've already got them. Well, I'm just gonna point, look there. You've got your lead for your uh, mechanical pencil okay, for your fine uh -huh. one. I'm going to show you why these are all, why you need them all um, shortly, and why they, what, what everything does. And look at all those there. All of those there are refills for your um, clutch pencil or your lead holder, the big chunky one. So you've got refills. You've got a couple of erasers, and they do different things. This is the type that you're probably well uh, uh, familiar with. Just a regular plastic eraser works a treat. Yeah. You've got this one here, which is a Needed eraser, needable eraser. We call it a putty eraser, a putty or a eraser. needed eraser, or a needable eraser. It's squidgy. It's like um, it's a bit like you know, like um, stuff you put your Christmas cards up in. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah. The, 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 when we open this, you'll see, and you shape it, and you use it any way you want, and it doesn't leave any little bits behind like that one. Okay. You can just lighten the background a little bit with it. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna be using them shortly. Going through, you've got three coloured pencils here that are great for just either mixing, for colouring in, or for like when you're doing, if you're doing a little sketchy ideas, you can do them in different colours for re represent different bits of your card making. So you might want to use the red as the foreground element if you're using your books and things to plan out your cards. Yeah. The, the blue might be a, a background, the next layer back, and the green might be further back, like just the flat bit of card. All of this will become apparent later. You've got two these are amazing if you've ever used water soluble graphite you'll you'll be excited already there's two here they look like pencil they're exactly like pencil but you don't have to even blend these ones you just add a bit of water there is a 2b and a 6b now this is where i get super excited What's this one like it's usually <gasps> a pastel a chalk pastel Ooh. pencil for all of your card making your paper crafting you want that yeah and you also want look Bab, bab, I'm not even going to take it out. This look. is what people are going to get excited about as well, that, that pen. There. Oh, mm. you, if, you've never, if you haven't used this pen yet, just do it. I mean, seriously, that and this kit alone, can you see where the money's just mounting up? I know. Yeah, it's just phenomenal. I have not even mentioned, look, you've got your pencil, a really good metal pencil sharpener there for all of your, um, your pencils, your regular pencils. Moving down, we've got a water brush, a fabulous, and it's a really nice size water brush. Oh, cool. It holds a really good point so if you want to add the water to your water soluble pencils just portable um it's perfect for that and that's going to go in this kit that you haven't even seen the bag yet yeah you got five illustrators there and they're the brush um nib illustrators which are my absolute go-to's perfect and they're shades of gray so you've got two cool grays you've got two warm grays and you've got a black You've got all of these art liners and you've got art liners here that you can't get anywhere else. Mm -hmm. These two here, and there's a chisel nib as well. Oh, is there? A chisel nib art liner. There's two flex pens here, which you won't get. Well, if you look at that, they've, we've, we've almost got like the price and just that and that. Of, of the kit. Well, I was going to say already, all of that is miles over. Miles over, miles, miles over. over. You've got paper stumps to blend your um, your graphite pencils with. Uh, that's that's the top layer. Then we move on. I think I've covered everything, haven't I? Yeah. Oh, look at the beauty of this. So in here, this is great. You have a case, and I've got mine all set up, which I'll show you properly shortly. But in there, everything fits perfectly. There's a place for everything in that case. Yeah. And there's also a place for the next thing, which is, which are the books. Look at this. Right, now if you're wondering about the value of sketchbooks, let me pop that to one side. Um, let me show you what I've brought my sketchbooks here. Just let me take you through that. They're just three of my sketchbooks, yeah. right? That one I paid 11.50 for. Yes. That one was 15. Right. This one was 36 pounds. 
And guess what's in this one? Nothing, because I'm scared to use it. Hang on, 36, 20... 36 um, quid for that. 26 and 11, did you say? Yeah, yeah, for these three. These ones have got bits in. I've been brave enough to do a few bits in these oh, ones. Wow. But, but, this, this one, not, because I'm scared to use it. Yeah. But look what, I, what, what you've got here. You've got two A4. They're totally different. Again, we're going to go through this in proper time and um and basically play this one here is a mixed media book so if you want to for a crafter yeah you could use this book for your color charts you know when i say always make a color mm. chart this would be yeah like yeah your, it could be a card making bible you could have your aquas color chart and you've got them all safe in the like there. That's good. then yeah. you can have your inks you can have your uh, duet ink pad colors in there and then swatch them so you can see all the colors you've got your shimmer inks you've got uh, so you can see how even that would work for a paper crafter um it, it's just it, it's phenomenal but you it's not watercolor card it won't take a completely um soak in wash but it's thick enough to use water products on there yeah. as well so that's your mixed media pad uh -huh. there and then we've got this beauty here oh. this this if you if you separated this and gifted this on its own it's it's sewn it's a proper sewn with signatures you know they call the little bits and that the little different things the little mm. signature there it's a sewn bound paper that is smooth silky smooth so all your dry media your inks are, and everything are going to work perfectly on this i'll show you how i've started to use mine shall i shall i show you mine quickly before yeah we why not you? this one's mine oh. that folder is brilliant as well isn't it my goodness it's me fabulous you can even just split up the if you're buying looking for gifts split up keep the pens give the folder away give oh, the pads away and whatever you want that's to do that's what it looks like when it's together ben look mm. everything's got its place I've, I've put my pencils i've got all my pens here for drawing and i've go, gone large to small to fine yeah. we haven't even shown you the how fine the lines are but due to doing all this when we're going to draw shortly um not draw scribble play over stamps and things yeah. um and everything's there and then in here you've got all your other bits your paper stump your pencil sharpener your eraser everything fits in there and then in here you have your books i mean to the fact that you can carry everything can you see what i'm saying you are going to be like if you give this to someone this christmas they're going to think you've been generous beyond beyond compare. generous because and this is how we're going to use them so if you think i'd like a lovely sketchbook like me little sketchbook but i can't draw so you're thinking well yeah all right then douglas but where do i how do i do if i'm if i'm not drawing doesn't matter look would you know that this hasn't been just sketched wow yeah yeah would you mm -hmm. no you wouldn't would you mm -hmm. that is what we're going to show you how to do so you could make yourself a little journal like this brilliant it doesn't have to be just you know sketches like that but i think that looks rather pretty if you want to gather this. and also imagine whatever you do in this book you can then put on a card that's it so imagine sending <clears> a card that looks like this it look like you've done a hand um you know hand drawn card um this one was stamps that you'll be familiar with they're not even a stamp that's a stencil i'm going to show oh, you how wow, to okay. change them um using the pens that are in the kit um if you want to maybe purpose th repurpose this one and think well how can i use get value i'm again i haven't used it but i've started playing in the back you might want to make yourself oh, a desk nice. journal yeah yeah so this is a stencil this is a space that we're going to do today we're going to put a stamp on there and we're going to draw over that with the pen and then we're going to use some just die cuts to cut out and put panels in here for notes or goals for that month and it's going to be really pretty and it's like it could be a family kind of like what's happening at a glance um coffee table pretty little book there so can you see how it's not just if you're an artist for anybody and anyone in school yeah. honestly it is you're going to look like the best auntie ever you certainly are um, and by far and away the most popular item that we've had here uh, at crafters tv over the course of the last three weeks best chance to buy it today for christmas delivery that's all i'm going to say uh, you'll get triple points as well today which is incredible and don't forget you've got that um free shipping incentive as well so again just to reiterate that if you're in the uk it is free uk shipping boom if you're in the us it's a 50 dollars spend to get your free shipping and if you're shopping in the eu 20 
uh, euros is your uh, spend there and you will get free shipping. And that is across the whole website as well, not just on the show. So do take advantage of that. Uh, runs up until Monday, the 18th of December and the triple point ends at midnight tonight, wherever you may be. For those of you that were asking, we will have a look at the Christmas stockings again in just a few moments time. However, it is time to do the vote. So uh, it will be the vote for the demo of the day because well, you've got one card in this show to bung in, haven't mm, you? Absolutely, yeah. I was trying to remember, it feels like so long ago, wake up call, it was, was this one, wasn't it? Yes. Yes. Phew, I was start, starting to, to doubt myself. Well, this one is demo number one, if you want to vote for this one, using our fantastic craft kit alongside some of those beautiful papers that we've got on the three for two as well. That's demo number one. Then if you want to go for this one, using that beautiful Academy of Colour uh, stamp and pens onto there, that's demo number two with your little doggy and your ditzy floral papers in the background. Is it going to be demo number one? Or is it going to be demo number two? Up oh. to you guys at home, get those votes in. That is tough. I really like one, but I love two because it's really cute, see? Mm. What are you thinking? At home, uh, get your votes in. You've got as long as you want, really, as long as... Uh, no, not quite as long as you want. Well. We're, not, we're not staying here all night waiting for the vote. Oh, we'll, we'll roll over the vote till the next thing tomorrow morning. We'll be here all night. We'll reveal that, the winner you told. in 2024. Yes. Uh, then we can call it demo of the year so yeah let's do that yep. yeah okay we'll tell you uh on january the first so do stay tuned no we will we will tell you in a minute we will tell you in a minute um few comments coming through thank you to uh nick who says i um, haven't paid attention to this pro sketch pack but seeing how its components are packed in this binder makes me think about getting it hmm uh, best day to get it today um Will I get? Oh, will I get it by the twenty first? We can't guarantee because um, because obviously we'll pack things and send them as fast as we can. But then there's other elements and factors, of course, that you know we we obviously can't control. So we're saying that today is the best chance for you to get uh, your goodies by Christmas. But obviously we can't guarantee it. Right, stockings. Oh, one final Christmas question, Ooh, which I yeah. also didn't do in the quiz earlier on. How many rolls? Does Tom Hanks play in the movie Polar Express? Well, given I don't watch films, that's me out. Could be anything. Ah. Could be two, could be 200. Wouldn't have a clue. I'll tell you, it's somewhere between two and, two. and 200. Oh, OK. That narrows it down a lot. Nicola's gone with nine. Do you want to have a guess? I'll go for, I'm going to go for seven. Seven. Seven, yeah. Okay. What have you what what have you gone for, Jamie? James? Three. Three? Hmm. Three. What did you say? Oh low ball in it. I thought you went wobble wobble. Wobble 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 wobble. I'll go for three. Wobble wobble. Wobble wobble. Stockings! Stockings! The quiz, by the way, is just for a bit of fun. Um, these are brilliant. Uh, we've got my stocking, and then we've got the silly stocking on the other side, which is the Sarah Lily stocking. See what we did there? Well, it wasn't us, actually. It was Rhonda who came up with the idea for that one. Uh, but these are loaded full of Christmas goodies. Whether you're buying them for yourself to treat yourself, or whether you see the contents and you go, well, actually, there's a few little um, stocking fillers ticked off, however you want to do it. Great value for money. And as someone's pointed out a little bit earlier on, really great across the two, um, if you are new to craft, there's lots of goodies within these stockings. Just to say again, you don't get the actual stockings. This is just for illustrative purposes. Yeah. Woohoo! Take a bow, Mr. Mosby. Thank you. Take a bow. Beautiful Illust pronunciation. Thank you. Illustrative purposes only. Oh, head rush. Um, should be 55.93. Should be 73.77. Uh, you're paying 20 pounds or 28 dollars for mine. Let me delve in here and show you everything that you're going to be getting. I've got to be honest. Mine is good, right? But mine is better. No, I would agree with you. <gasps> I would agree with you. When when Sarah's in later on, though, I'll I'll argue the toss with her. I'll be like, no, no, mine's much, mine's much better than yours. What are you talking about? Just to wind her up, that, mm -hmm. that stocking over there is amazing. But this one, depends where your budget lies, right? But what I can tell you, for £20 or $28, your value is in three items. It's like you're buying three items and you're getting four, four free. Um, you've got your 
cut and emboss frame here. Beautiful cut and emboss frame in the um, Dancing Daffodils from our florals. Uh, that one again, about five and a half by five and a half the size on that one. This is what it's going to create you. Then you're also paying for a set of our sentiment stamps. So this is the special friend. Really like these actually because you've got the um, sentiment in different fonts and different sizes for all sorts of different projects. And the other one you're going to be paying for within the bundle is this one, which is your whimsical textures from the Enchanted Dreams collection. So yeah, a very handy stamp set. Nice little bundle of three that you're paying for. Then you get all the other goodies for free as it works out. One of our brilliant sort of edgeable sentiments this is the L-O-U. Hello. Um, so you, you, uh, you, uh, you <laughs> I'm going to miss that later on. Oh. Can you just record Lily saying it so you can drop it in on the next maybe, show? Maybe I'll just have to dial in yeah. from home. Whenever you need me yeah. to say that, just phone me up. i just go, yeah. hello, hello. I mean, I could be out running, but hey, I'll just yeah. do it. <laughs> hello. <laughs> running along the streets as somebody's walking past, I think, blimey, she's yeah. saying hello quite loudly. Not at you guys. I'm saying to the guys on the telly, of course. Yeah, I'm on the telly. Won't tell her. Well, I can't imagine. I did, I've just, I, was, I did you go, <gasps> hello. But I can't imagine that you probably pant as much as I do when you're running. I reckon you're just like, hello. Hello, love. <laughs> just running along. How far are you running tonight? Tonight, I'll probably do five miles. Oh, that's, yeah. that's nothing for you, is it? To be fair, I've got to, first off, I've got to go and do my food shop. Yeah. Carry that home, so two and a half mile walk home. Then I'll get changed, get ready, go out five miles. Back, back in the craft room, back in the zone. Where are you running to? Do you know what? I'll probably run here and back. <laughs> this, this is how sad I am. There's not a lot of nice places, let's be honest, to run mm. around here. So I quite often end up running to work and back. <sighs> Brilliant. Sad that, isn't it? There's a good running track just up the road that way. I know that's quite away from your house. Yeah, you, you, have, to, you have to pay to get in. They don't. The running track, like the proper one. No, the one just up there at um, Oakleaf. Oakleaf? Yeah. It's not free entry. I just go there all the time. I never... <laughs> I've never paid. Okay. Uh, okay. Moving swiftly on. Okay. Christmas stockings. <laughs> yes. Is breaking and entering <laughs> allowed? <laughs> Have you seen this man? <laughs> <laughs> Wanted. Wanted. Illegal runner. <laughs> <laughs> He's on the run, literally. Quite literally. Brilliant. Um, love it. Absolutely yep. love it. Can you imagine? Uh, <laughs> so good job you have been running so you can run away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly right. <laughs> run away from the long arm of the law. Uh -oh. um, pom poms, pom pom, pom maker, pom. four piece pom pom maker set. So uh, this gives you everything that you need apart from your, um, your yarn, which is not included, to make your pom poms. So you're going to make three and a half, um, seven and nine centimetre size pom poms there. So again, something a little bit different. Nice little Christmas stocking filler for anyone who loves their um, crafty bits and pieces. You'll get one of our dotty tape pens as well. You guys love this. Great for doing all of your intricate sticks. One of the original ones, of course, don't forget, 22 metres, 72 feet on there. Plus, you'll get the Bella Luna Vellum. Um, 24 sheets in there. You've got six different designs, four of each within that set. I've just heard in my ear that it looks like that the running track that I do sometimes... I mean, I don't go all there all the time. It's just now and again, I just, I just go there. Under Apparently, the cover of darkness, of course. Yeah, with my balaclava on. Yeah. Uh-oh, a legal run it's about. Uh, apparently it does look like you can go and oh. use it for free. I might have to get myself up there then. It is mm. good. It's like the sports hall that they've got there. Obviously I don't go yeah. to the sports hall and just, you know, kick around in there. Yeah. Or... <laughs> On your own, playing football. <laughs> one team, one man football team. Brilliant. <laughs> Great game, that one. What was the score, score tonight? Oh, it was uh, nil nil again. Yeah, yeah, nil nil again. Nil nil. Stiff competition. Um, Carol Ann says, time to get ordering again. I've been so engrossed in the show that I actually haven't made it to the checkout yet. Um, Sandra says, got an order in for three of the ditzy floral pads. Uh, we'll do demo of the show, but in a minute. But thank you for all your guesses on um, how many characters does Tom Hanks play in the movie Polar Express. Apparently it is... It's not seven. Seven! <laughs> yeah! Now that was uncanny. Anybody that knows me knows that was an absolute fluke because I never watched films. Never seen the film in my life. That was literally a pure guess. So... Blimey me. I think I should put the lottery on with that sort of look. Good yeah, grief. Yeah, yeah. Congratulations. Well done. Ooh. You win 
nothing. You win the opportunity to show us what's in your stocking. Yeah, I'd love to, because as we have found out throughout the course of today already, my stocking is better than Ben's. <laughs> <laughs> and to be honest, though, it's technically not my stocking, is it? It's Sarah's Christmas stocking. Whoever's Christmas stocking it is, it is absolutely amazing value for money. There's yeah. even something that doesn't fit in this actual stock in That's itself. That's unbelievable. Amazing, is it? £24.32 if you're part of our Platinum Club. You are going to save £79 or $100. Amazing. Let's start off with our 12 by 12 paper pad, though. This is part of our Sarah Signature Wild at Heart collection. We are bringing to you a 37 sheet, double sided, 180 GSM paper pad. This is absolutely gorgeous. Really quite different when it comes to this fabulous paper pad. Of course, we know and love our florals, but what we've done is we've fused our beautiful floral designs alongside some of those fabulous, really funky animal prints. So you've got your zebra prints, your leopard prints, your cheetahs, all of those amazing different prints that we've got running through that pad. You've even got your almost like your gold faux flecking on there just beautiful super stylish really quite designer looking with this paper pad as well it is fantastic 37 sheets and as we come to the final page within this paper pad you have all of your sentiments something really quite quirky about yeah. about these as well it's not just your standard sort of happy birthday you've got things like you are enough birthday girl keep it sassy love keep that one it sassy. why on earth not a eh? sprinkle with love just take your trimmer your guillotine or your scissors to those and you've got lots of ready-made sentiments all good to go and that's just one element as part of this amazing christmas stocking but as we delve into our stocking and have a look at all the goodies we have got contained within here there is literally tons and tons and tons for that small price point today let's start off with one of our amazing stencil sets this being our spots and dots three different stencils included as part of this collection largest one being a whopping eight and a half inch square so it's going to be perfect for those large projects maybe in your scrapbook pages as well bring in your glitter paste bring in your inks your shimmer sprays or even uh, dry emboss these through your die cutting machine it's going to give you the most amazing results it's going to take you crafting the whole year through that is for certain then we move on to a fantastic set of nine dies these are layering dies that allow you to cut the different layers from different colors of cardstock layer those together to get that fantastic sentiment design with that gorgeous little present on there as well talking of dies we've also got one of these fantastic little uh, mini dies this is great as a finishing touch as an embellishment onto your cards that being that beautiful butterfly design there now we're going to get more dies but tons included as part of this kit you're getting eight separate dies here all your different layers for your peony flowers you've even got the tiny little blooms there the leaves and that stamen as well that can go into the center of those beautiful flowers then we bring to you something ever so cute, really sweet, this uh, set of stamps and dies. You've got the stamps for both the front and the reverse of that gorgeous little doggy. You've got the matching die that allows you to cut it out as a tag or perhaps a bookmark as well. And then you've also got the most fabulous sentiments, including mine and Ben's new favourite, Yappy Birthday. Yeah, Yappy Birthday. Yappy Birthday. Love that. I think that's absolutely <sighs> fantastic. Then we come on to our garden gnomes, our gnome boy stamp and die set. Not just stamps, not just dies, but also stencils that allow you to add the designs to his clothes as well super fun to build up that design and customize that with complete and utter ease even more stamps and dies included yeah. in the christmas stocking that just goes on and on and on let's be honest you have got your fantastic embellishment stamps with the matching dies really useful sentiments as well as those gorgeous little embellishments things like butterflies and flowers the sorts of icons that we use day in day out in it, when it comes to our crafting and then we have got another set of fantastic uh, chipboard uh, embellishment stickers here coming to us as part of the Violet Studios Nutcracker collection. These are all self adhesive and a chipboard with some metallic details as well. Great for all of those Christmas creations following in that gorgeous Nutcracker theme. Then we're bringing to you 400 stamens that were part wow. of the Sarah Signature Country Lane collection. Two different shades of your green on there. Fantastic to add to the center of both your paper and your foam flowers. Either material is gonna work a treat alongside those. Then an essential tool with our edge crimper allows you to slot your paper or card into there to give you that lovely distressed finish on the edges of your papers and your card stocks. And then finally, oh, oh she's there. Me. It's the one Ooh. that goes on forever, this. I know, literally it's a bottomless Christmas stocking with this mm. one. Amazing. Three rolls of your low tack tape, 75 meters on each, giving you an awful lot of sticking power. It's gonna be great for taping your dies into position, for use of your stencils and your masks and all those masking techniques as well. Definitely essential to get in your craft stash. So fabulous to have that included as part of your stocking as well. All of these crafty goodies, for just £24 or $32. And don't forget as well, free shipping here in the UK or if you're spending over $20 uh, twenty Euros or $50. And also triple points as well. So it's literally never been a better time to grab yourself a bargain. It's going to be amazing for Christmas 
gifts or a treat for yourself as well however you choose to go for this one get those baskets checked out as soon as you can uh unbelievable value for money across that stocking uh yeah and but mine as well i mean come on, don't <gasps> oh, forget oh oh oh, oh she's missed one and oh, she's the, missed one the pom-poms the ones that match my jumper the pom-poms you're also getting those as well so we thought it was bottomless and there's literally even more included so it just gets better and better and better 36 of those sorry ben back to you keep discovering more in that stocking <sighs> just um do it give it another little just anything else in there anything else no that's it I think. I sure. Have. Sure. Any more in yours? Probably not. The sass. I know. I'm getting from the other side of the, the but studio. But you can't wait for Sarah to be in at six o'clock. Oh, I mean. Bring oh, her back. Bring, bring back some decorum. What a way to finish the day. Um, just before we do the, um, the, the, the demo of the day, but a few of you saying, well, who are the seven characters that Tom Hanks plays in, um, in, in Polar Express? Oh, you've got to be worried then, because if you, if you think it's six, apparently he plays uh, Hero Boy. The kid, he plays Hero Boy's father, uh, the conductor of the Polar mm -hmm. Express, because the conductor just looks like him, doesn't he? Have you ever seen it? Have you? Come no. on now, this is a film. Have I seen it? Of course I haven't. <laughs> uh, he plays Hobo. Right. He plays Santa Claus. Oh, hang on a minute. That is only Hero Boy. Hero Boy's father, conductor, Hobo, Santa Claus. Oh, yeah, that is only six. Where did I get seven from? <laughs> Hero Boy, Conductor. I'm going to have to relook at this again in a second. I, did, I read seven somewhere. It's six or seven. Maybe you didn't get the answer right after all. Oh. Well, I'm glad I didn't after ask all, that, that question all in the quiz. After all this excitement, I'm feeling quite, quite low now. Mm -hmm. um, well, let's um, make you feel a bit better. Uh, well, I was going to say, give you the demo of the day, but you're going to win well, that I anyway. Well, should put me well up. So if I don't get demo of the day, there's something going wrong here. That's for certain. Demo of the day. Show. The day. Day. Oh. Two. Two. Is there something wrong with that? No, I just, I don't know. I just kind of thought that more people would go for, go for but, one. But we all love a cute little doggy. Look at him. He's adorable. He's even got a little bow in his hair. Look at that. And his bow even matches the papers. You can't go wrong. Even got a bow on the, and some ribbon there. Yeah. Ultimate papers in the background, the glittering gold 12 by 12 pad, bit of Centura Pearl as well for the card base. Of course, you won't look at him. Oh, do, do, do. oh you a beauty little doggy. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, do, 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 do. do you know what I thought would have been quite nice actually with this? And I'm, I'm quite disappointed in myself that I didn't think of this. I should have put the happy birthday sentiment on there, shouldn't I? What a Blanca. That would have oh, just made yeah. it amazing. Yappy, was it Yappy Christmas? Yapp yappy birthday. Oh, Yappy birthday. Yappy birthday. If you guys at home are getting your hands on the Academy of Colour and that amazing stocking, make sure you make that card with the fantastic little Yappy birthday on, because I think that'd be amazing. It could be a card to your dog, it could be a card from your dog. But Yappy birthday, you can't go wrong with that sentiment, can you? Uh, Ben's just lost. So I'm still trying just... to find, sorry. Hero boy, count them. Hero boy's father, conductor, yeah. hobo, Oh, and then the page runs out. I'm going to find out. It's seven. I read seven. Just before we disappear, we've only got two minutes. Uh, the, the template, the original template library yep. is still in stock. Yeah. And have you seen the saving? We say it's still in stock, but it won't be for much longer, especially at this price, and we have not got many of these left in stock. Wow, amazing platinum colour price on this one, just £36 or $39.20. It should be just shy of £90 or just shy of $100. This is amazing for creating your shape cards, your different shapes of boxes and envelopes as well. As part of this collection, you get both all of the recipe cards, which is what I'm about to show you, and you do also get all the templates in the binder as well. But let's have a little look first up at our fantastic recipe cards. So we've got this beautiful book here where we've got all of our different um, templates there. 30 different templates and projects included. As you go through this booklet, you can see there you've got the photo of the finished project and then you've got step-by-steps in both picture and word form and it's the same for all of those 30 different templates. They're all numbered so that you know, for example, this one's number 10. So say if I want to create that, all I need to do is then go to my template um, booklet here. You've got all these reusable templates. Just take them out of the folder, pop them back in, find number 10, that's the one I want to create. Take it out of the folder, pop it back in once you've done with it, draw around it, create the card, super, super easy. This is literally a whistle stop tour, but you do also get all of your <laughs> dies, including a magnetic sheet. Honestly, this is the most amazing system uh, to create those shape 
cards, to create those concept cards and boxes and envelopes with absolute ease. But to get all of those templates, to get all of the pictures and the step by steps included for £36 or $39, it's absolutely amazing. Why don't you check out those baskets? Hero Boy, Hero Boy's father, conductor, ghost on top of the train, Scrooge puppet, narrator, and Santa Claus. Seven. Um, thank you so much to Lily. Uh, thank we'll you. see you very soon. I'll see you in an hour because guess who's coming in? Yeah, the crafty whirlwinder. South Sarah will be here for Crafters Christmas Shopping Day, part three. See you in a bit.